out of here. Faith Care 1436. Who's back inside? What is the problem? What's the scholarship? What's the scholarship? What's the scholarship? What's the scholarship? Okay, let me give it a minute, yeah? But ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. Bob, you can have your see. You can have it for you. Okay, now this is what we're going to do, yeah? In a very special way, I want you guys to let you know that today is going to be an awesome day. Even after here, we're going to praise God and worship God tonight. How many of you ready to worship God tonight? You ready? You ready? But as the team is getting ready, we have a special presentation from the Joyful Generation. As they get ready, as they get ready, okay? As they get ready, I want you to know one thing, yeah? Here, we in the house of the Lord, amen? Amen? Amen. 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 One thing I surely know, that today, today, after today, I've been believing God for something very special. I believe even before this year ends, it's going to come through. Amen? So, don't give up, yeah? Don't give up. The year has not ended. It's still going on. Amen? Amen. We are having baptism. Those of you that get, want to get baptized or you need to get baptized, please make sure you register so that they prepare your baptism card. And immediately after baptism today, you need to go home with your baptism card. Amen? Amen. And also, our lunch is ready. Okay? Amen. In a few minutes, we shall also be going for our lunch. And we shall be going for our lunch. Yeah. And then after that, ha ya ya, Musumba Robert Kai, Emo Robert Kai, Jadjuni Ayingireo, Pasakaksa Ayingireo, Tuwerenga Tuwereza, Amen? Okay. 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 Uh, and also, the guys who want their t-shirts, the royal t-shirts, yeah? On the first day, please make sure you see this guy. Okay, in fact, first, they are here. Make sure you just see me and I'll direct you to the guy, yeah? And you get your t-shirts, amen? Yes. Amen. Okay, so, ladies and gentlemen, Nete, Nete! Nete, Nete! Since we have a who's this here, why don't I use English? I bring, I bring! I bring, I bring! What will you give me? Not to say this. That will... Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Now the next artists are very old here at Miracle Center Cathedral, and they do their ministry through music. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the Wings Music. Wings Music. Jesus is alive. He's the gospel we preach.
you, you remove the rubber band sister. <laughs> Joyful 
choice. Hey. Okay, let's hear the loudest voice. Make some noise for her. Make some noise for her. What's your shoe size? 39. 39, eh? This is 37. Let me get for you some other shoes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> this was not fit. Don't fit. I know you check for 39 over there. That's 40. That, that's what? Let us try them on. Okay. Uh, now, the, these are the people. Uh, Mirembe Esther Maria, please come for your t shirt. Uh, make, make sure you see the other guy. Uh, where is he? I see one at the uncle now. Now, but uh, he is there. You come in. Yeah. No, him. Yes. Mirembe Esther, you see the man in pink. Sick way. Body, no body. Okay. here at Robert Kanja Ministries, yeah. the rappers. Ladies and gentlemen, help me welcome. You know the boys got the what? Yeah. Make some noise for new empire. Yeah. You know the boys got the dance.
Thing, yeah? Yeah, yeah, we have the eating competition yeah. also over there we want to see and also we want we have a cooking competition we want to see if you guys can make good cooks yeah <laughs> hey I can't wait to see my people from South Africa Tomanya amen thank you so much for coming through and people, most people always ask me, Dangote, why do you talk a lot about the whites? Mazima. <laughs> Number one, the reason is like this. When I when I, I used to date this friend of mine, eh? And I didn't come But the day we broke up. You know how you bazungus when you break up with people, you say like, you know, you're, you're done with me? It's okay, no problem. No, no problem, it's okay. You're good? I wish you the best. But only I'm the CEO of my life. I'm the boss of myself. Living my good life. But haters want a man. Ex wandawa. Never go back to my face. I thank you so much guys for coming through guys. Man. Okay, now I have pairs of shoes to give out. Size 39, 37 and some money. Okay? Now I'm going to request for four people. Okay? Four people. I want one from the back, one from the other side, one from here and one from here. Okay? I'm not saying you should come. I'm not saying. Sina wakuita, sina babaita. Eh? Okay. Ready? Ready? Make some noise! The guy, the guy in yellow. The guy, uh -uh. The guy putting 
Simon Yellow. Then there's another guy behind with a uh, how with the red catamala. Ah, uh, uh, yes, you, 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 ah, uh, uh, you. Now, can I thank you so much. Okay. And also, uh, okay, you can come the two. Okay. Those are four, right? He's lost, eh? I want to get it on Mulala. Hey, you hurry up. But it's like, I, 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 for you, you already won. I, I remember this face on day one. <laughs> Don't you remember this face? Hey, I remember this face very well. For you, you already won. <laughs> you want shoes, right? Yeah, now you. <laughs> I didn't give you one. Slivia Angel. Angel. Where do you come from? Tundwe. Presenting from Motundwe. And is anyone from Motundwe? Motundwe, <laughs> make some noise. But if I don't get a password, uh, eh? you're ready for my question. How often do you read your Bible? Two times. Two times in like a day, in a week, in a month, a year. A week. A week. Oh, you're just copying and pasting what she's saying. Was the disciple replaced Judas Iscariot? What's your name? My name is Tony Gorati. Gorati, where do you come from, Gorati? Bolenga. Bolenga. Representing Bolenga. How often do you read your Bible? You don't read your Bible. You've never read a Bible. Are you born again? Yeah. You're born again. You don't read your Bible. Are you serious? Are you serious? What's the problem? What's the problem? You are newly born again. Oh my God! Hey, you are giving your life to Christ. Is it? Don't, you just don't have a Bible, over. 
not have. Ah, no, you don't, for you don't need shoes. You need money. You need to go and buy a Bible. Hey, you need, you need a Bible. Serious man. Ah, you go and uh, buy a Bible. Then we start from, what's your name? Goretti, yeah? Where? Mutoni Goretti. Next Saturday, for your service, you need to be around. I need to make sure that you're bought the Bible. Amen? Come on, let's appreciate how one more time. I want to the kingdom of God, yeah? One thing I want to tell you is that now that you've given your life to God, make sure that you never leave the presence of God. And not ever at any moment. Amen? And all is here to read the word of God. I'm telling you, God will do miracles, signs, and wonders in your life. Let's clap for her, ladies and gentlemen. What's your beautiful name, my guy? Kenya okay, Ronald. From where? Seka. Seka. Anyone from Seka? Seka, where are you? You're ready for my question. How often do you read your Bible? Three times a week. Three times a week. Ha, now I need to give you a hard one. Three times a week. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. You know John 316, right? Does it say? Somebody in Beko, you are clapping now to my question. Since you know John 316, how about John 317? For God so loved the world that you what? No, come on, you, you can't read the 316 and fail to read 317. Uh, it says that for the Son of Man did not come into the world for the wind. That's all, Chichi. Over. Sente Gato. Sente. What's your shoe size? 42. 42. Well, this is what? This is 45. Come on, come on. We say it. Then you start from there. Start from there. So, as we're heading into the next section, I want to invite. invite our next performers on stage right then after that shit i'm going to do another giveaway we have the food eating competition we have the cooking competition lots of money to give out today smartphones today we come at being the last day is just for giving christmas very early amen all right invite the next performers one stage. more time yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody say yeah yeah. Somebody say yeah yeah. Let's say let's say. Let's say let's say. Guys, I get ready to go for crazy. It's a crazy moment. I get ready for crazy. Are you ready for crazy? Are you ready for crazy?
to let you know that uh, immediately after them coming on, we are going to be having some competitions. We are going to be having eating competitions. You don't joke with God's daily bread. You're going to come here, show us the capacity of your stomach and your mouth. In case you win, we have prizes for you. Then, we also have... How many of you know how to cook? Each team will be having five people. All right? Yes. So you will be competing against each other in frying the best omelette. Yeah. The pastor, the team that wins, wins his prizes. Are we ready for that? Yeah. But ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. We love you so very much. You are welcome. You are welcome. But this stage has terms and conditions. You, you come with vibe and live with vibe. Amen. You go there and you guys come with vibe. Mazima. Side what? Now we introduce your first. And then you come back with vibe. We love you so much. This is how we 
people. Let's, let's get it going here. Mukama Ibo Zibwe! When I know your name, eh? So are you acquainted, girl? Lazina. If you get it, if you don't get it, forget about it. I want to know your names also. And also, status in Singoro, Maredi, Oma, we are believing God. Let's start our phrase. Hello, my name is Marley. Hello, my name is Bianca. You tell us. I have a boyfriend. Oh. Hello everyone, my name is Carly and this is my lovely husband. My name is James Jacobo. This is my beautiful wife Carly. She's taken. She's mine. Hello, everyone. I'm Joe. You want me to ask her? Are you single? Are you married? I'm single. I'm single. I'm single. I gotta look fresh, eh? Hello everyone, I'm Abigail and I am who the Lord says I am. Hello everybody, I'm Tracy and I'm in love with Jesus. Almighty is my everything. Hello everybody, I'm Michael and I'm single too. Mazina. Sayuka Kong Pola. Sayuka Kong Jim. Pola. Together, Masu. Let's go ahead. Hello everyone, I'm Carla and this is my beautiful husband, Marco. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Hi everyone, my wife already said my name, but I'm just going to say it again. Marco. Marco. Hello everyone. Hello. My name is Martin, yeah. and I'm also single. What was your name again, sir? Ma Martin. Martin. Martin, yes. Hey, Martin. <laughs> I'm going to give you a Luganda name. Ah, no, 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 no. Let me give you a name from Arua. You know, you know, USA, United States of Arua. Have you ever been to the United States of Arua? Oh my God, you gotta go there. That's where I can come from, yeah? I come from the USA. The land is full of old men. I'm here, yeah. Yeah. Wow. So the name I'm going to give you is Opolot Martin. Opolot. 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 Yes, Opolot Martin. But you know, that name is, is, is very powerful. What does it mean? It means someone who is happy, joyful, and fun. Oh. Mazina. Oh. Eh? Ma you take it? Yes. Martin, you said you're single, eh? Mm. You're single. First, also ask the, the, you see that one next to you, eh? Yeah? Mix you when we're coming back 
Pastor Ryan, exactly. we must say that we testified. Our you lives can't. never remain the you same. Can't. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, now this next brother of mine, he's a brother from another mother. Now, I met him over Preacher's Corner. Uh -huh. And, uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, make some joyful noise for Pastor Sam over there, man. I am an evangelist by call. These are my wonderful friends from South Africa. We love you all. Bless you. Amen, amen. Now, before I let you go, who wants to, I want, I want, I want someone from you guys to just give us one word in a minute. Just share one of those powerful, a word that you feel like the Lord has put in your heart and you want to share with us. You're debating about it. Okay, let's go. Hallelujah! Amen. I only have one minute. It's impossible to share the word in one minute, but I'll give you something in a minute. I want to tell you that when Moses was called, when there was the burning bush, God said, Moses, Moses. And Moses said, Here I am. And then God said to Moses, Go back to Egypt and tell the Pharaoh to let my people go. And Moses replied and he said, God, but who am I to go back to Egypt? And God's response was, it's not about who you are, it's about who I am. God says that I am who I am. Go back to Egypt and tell them the God, I am who I am, has sent you. And I want to tell you today, the fact that we are in Uganda is a miracle. Two days before we flew to Uganda, we didn't have enough money to come here. And God provided. I want to tell you, it's not about your ability or your inability. It's about your availability. Hallelujah. Is anyone here available for the Lord? Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for that powerful word. Amen. Now, you're still around with us today. We're going to have a great time in the presence of God. We're going to praise God. We're going to worship God. We're going to hear testimonies. The Lord has a very, very powerful message for each one of us in this place. Amen? Amen. How many of you believe that the Lord has a very powerful message for you? And you're ready to receive it tonight. Listen. Now, as you go out back and take your seats, I want to share this with you, with the guys. Please, let's, let's appreciate them one more time, yeah? As they're having their seats, yeah? Hey, you, you get the microphone now. Okay, now as they're having their seats, I want to remind you guys that Riot is just not a day for having fun, amen? Yes, sir. Amen? Yes, sir. Of course we are having the fun, but I'm telling you, how many of you were here on the first day and the second day? And you saw the presence of God. You saw the move of the, of the Holy Spirit inside there. I'm telling you, now what he did the other day, the previous days, today is going to be more than that. You know, you know why? Because these things are from glory to glory. Riot, today is your day. Pastor Naksa, this, was the, this, is, this is actually where he gave his life to Christ, right? And right now, he's our youth pastor. So you never know what the Lord can do in your life. Amen? Amen. So without wasting time, Ladies and gentlemen, we are going into our eating competitions right now. Majima. Uh, yes, of course I said yes, yes. My envelope is full, full now. <laughs> okay. Nete, nete. Nete, nete. Somebody make some noise for Jesus. I want you to give us the, the terms and conditions for this competition. 
I think so. The terms and conditions for this competition. How many of you wear kakasa? Now wear kakasa. Then shadow you never. Now wear kakasa to Mulia. You don't talk with God's daily bread. I need you guys. Let me first tell you what's going to happen. So, in just one minute.
I need you to pair up. I need the girls alone and the boys alone. Girls alone, boys alone. Together, Chad, I'm starting with number one. So, ah, uh, see the ladies first. See the ladies first. So, you're eating two buns. I need a timer. Alex, so for now, a timer. Two buns, eh? In one, in one, in one, in 60 seconds, eh? 60 seconds. Okay, so we start with who is starting first? Who is going first? Who is starting first amongst you? We start. Do we me super sala bingo play bagat statue again again statue? Yeah. Ah, Jafuano. Yeah. 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 So just one minute, sixty seconds. Yeah. You eat the bar and what? What else? No, without water. Without water. Yes. Two, Two bars. <laughs> In one minute without water. This water is this water is just for emergency. In case you choke, now wait a Okay. Yeah. Ready? Are you ready? Three, two, one, start.
the same. You do it 50k. What do you want? You want this one? No, we do the bar. We do the bar. Let's 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 be consistent. Yeah? 50k. 50k. Ready? Okay. 50k. Ah, uh, let's go. One, two, three.
this one. 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 This I give you what? Another one. Another chance. Another chance. You want another chance to eat bread? Okay, we do this. You take the t-shirt, you get 20k. T-shirt plus 20k. Is that okay? Yeah? Okay, okay, now you come for your money. But as for the rest, I didn't want to them from the ladies. From the ladies, eh? From the ladies, who? Who tried? Who tried? Who? 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 So what should we do for them? Yeah? We do what? Do we let them we dance, dance, eh? dance. We give them a big answer. Okay. The rest you come in front here. You come and dance.
instructs on hospitality, uh, anyone from hospital to come and give us the instructions for food so that we go and go. Hey, are you ready for salad? Before you qualify. So the serving center is 
The other side, you go through church. They will lead you through church. Ministers, the first serving center there. So if you are a minister, go to Mueleza. Mueleza now. Serving center, I'm ready to in the corner. Yes. The corner. The other four serving centers. The same line. Which other four centers? The same line. Okay, so in the same line, we have four serving centers at the back. Okay? So is someone going to usher them? Yes. By the we have team. Okay, so you wait where you're seated. By name, to Lindeko, to Lindeko, to Lindeko. Wait where you're seated. The dream team guys are going to come and usher you. Okay? Yes. Alright, so in the meantime, I want to pass this announcement. How many of you would like to see Pastor Robert Kayanja playing basketball? How many of you would like to see Pastor Robert Kayanja Jr. playing basketball? How many of you would like to see Pastor Zach, Pastor Zach playing basketball? For 30 minutes, okay? After 30 minutes, make your way to the basketball court. Okay? We shall be there briefly. We need to keep time. Amen. So we shall be there for just 30 minutes as well. So we are going to eat for 30 minutes and then we shall play basketball for 30 minutes. Now before we play that game, we are going to do some some giveaways. Amen. Amen. How many of you can score? Can can shoot and score? Eh, 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 eh. Okay, we shall meet you there. So every for every basket you get, you, you get. They will let you know. You might win a prize. Amen. So 30 minutes we are eating food. And 30 minutes we are at the basketball court. Then after that, we shall be coming back here. Amen. And that's when we're going to get into our baptism. We're going to get into the worship. We're going to get into the word. Pastor Robert Kanja is in the house. Pastor Robert Kanja is in the house. Pastor Robert Kanja is going to be praying for us. He's going to be laying hands on us. And we're going to be filled with the Holy Spirit. Amen. Wow, wow. Today is your day. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. I stand the gamba riot. Hallelujah. So dream team, let's be quick. Let us try to save time. Those of you watching us by television, please make your way. If you've never been baptized, this is your opportunity. Some of you are born again, but you've not been baptized. Okay? So use this opportunity. Hallelujah. Don't let this moment pass you by. Amen. 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 Yeah. Okay, let's have some music. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, as we go. As the rest of the people are going for lunch, I just want to read a couple of messages from the people that are watching us. Uh, if you're at home and you're watching us, you can go and stream us on Robert Kanja Ministries uh, on, on YouTube. Uh, Robert Kanja Ministries on YouTube. And we shall be definitely to get in touch with you. Bira Jessica says, this is, ama this is amazing. I wish I could be there. The Sima P says, this is the last day of Raya 2022 Miami. They should have increased for us. This one says, uh, Naka Jumi J says, every day is in Jack. Ugenda Kuria Banam. This one says, thank you, Holy Spirit. Samata Richard is on. Sanyo Chels is on. Uh, uh, Richard is on. Ruby Ruby is on. Uh, Peace is on. Uh, Chisachi Sarah is on. Sanyo is on. Uh, Prosy Richel is on. Julian Daisy, Ryan, Mwanguzi Jessica, Luanga Jacob, uh, who else is here? Um, some of these names, man, I'm just going to skip them. My Luganda is not Luganda. El Semata, uh, Peace, Jaya, Bukira, uh, 
But I keep the conversations coming through. We're still going ahead with our riot. This is the last day. It's been an amazing day. We started off with baptism coming on after. But right now we're going for lunch. And uh, after that we shall come and have a powerful one. Worship, going for the basketball. Uh, so, to the guys that enjoy their food, Bon appétit. But uh, so make sure you work with your property. Yeah, you take good care of your property, yeah? Do it's very your important. Property in the chair. Please move with it when you're going to get food. Yeah, yeah. All right, have a uh, nice lunch. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, by the grace of God, the Spirit of the Lord told me, he said, rush this gift to my people. I don't know what's coming. We've been through Ebola, through COVID-19, but one of the things that was, I was very much concerned that the people of God were not taking Holy Communion. So the Lord told me, because all these things you see here, the word of God is, is symbol of covenant, the lion and the lamb, symbol of covenant, the bread and the blood, symbol of covenant, the cross, the fish. When you see the Ark of a Covenant, the manoa, if you see all the things, they all talk about the covenant. And when Jesus Christ came, he said, this is is my body this is my blood do this in remembrance of me so, so child of God that's why I designed this it's no imitation no one can imitate it because it has got our ministry logo Robert Kayanja Ministries and his Holy Communion the meal that heals it's all engraved it's custom made you can get it either in white or black it's so beautiful it's designed just for you and when you open it up you will find very beautiful um, elements of Holy Communion and people of God this is really amazing and this is for you it's easy to open you'll find it has got the Holy Communion it has got the box for the bread and it has got the olive oil three elements that are really making a difference in people's lives here at the miracle center cathedral we have seen miracle signs and wonders when people took Holy Communion child of God I want you to get one of this as you help me Bless Karamoja. Karamoja needs our help. 
Well, this thing is only 50,000 shillings. So, or more. If you give 50,000 shillings or more to help us as a love gift, we are not selling it, we are just offering it to you as a love gift. Give it to your child, give it to your mama, give it to everybody else, even, even the sick people in the hospital. Even when you're going to travel on the plane, this is, this is very, very uh, convenient for you. You will not find it either in America or around the world. This was given to me by the Holy Spirit to design it. So child of God, get ready to get this. This will be a blessing to you. And then when you do, you are ready to take Holy Communion anywhere in the world. Whether you are farming, whether you are working, you just pull out your box and you just get out your bread. And you said, this is your blood, Father. Bear me and heal me and deliver me in Jesus' mighty name. And then after you do that, you close it. And then you pull out your, the blood of Jesus Christ. So this can serve you three times a day. He said, do this in the of me. Then you left the, the third one. And then after that, you pray and you anoint yourself with oil. And this is going to be a blessing to all of you. And you just put it there and you're ready to run. Please, get the Holy Communion um, component and it will be a blessing to you. It is only, don't go for imitations. Just come for the original. It is Robert Kanja Ministries, Holy Communion, a mirror that he heals. It's very small, very tidy. You keep it yourself and you pray. And this is a powerful weapon. Get it in the black or white or both. God richly bless. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. By the grace of God, the Spirit of the Lord told me, he said, rush this gift to my people. I don't know what's coming. We've been through Ebola, through COVID-19, but one of the things that was, I was very much concerned that the people of God were not taking Holy Communion. So the Lord told me, because all the things you see here, the word of God is, is symbol of covenant, the lion and the lamb, symbol of covenant, the bread and the blood, symbol of covenant, the cross, the fish. When you see the Ark of a Covenant, the Manoah, if you see all the things, they all talk about the covenant. And when Jesus Christ came, he said, this is is my body this is my blood do this in remembrance of me so, so child of God that's why I designed this it's no imitation no one can imitate it because it has got our ministry logo Robert Kayanja Ministries and his Holy Communion the meal that heals it's all engraved it's custom made you can get it either in white or black it's so beautiful it's designed just for you and when you open it up you will find very beautiful um, elements of Holy Communion and people of God this is really amazing and this is for you it's easy to open you'll find it has got the Holy Communion it has got the box for the bread and it has got the olive oil three elements that are really making a difference in people's lives here at the Miracle Center Cathedral we have seen miracle signs and wonders when people took Holy Communion child of God I want you to get one of these as you help me Bless Karamoja. Karamoja needs our help. Well, this thing is only 50,000 shillings. So, or more. If you give 50,000 shillings or more to help us as a love gift, we are not selling it. We are just offering it to you as a love gift. Give it to your child. Give it to your mama. Give it to everybody else. Even, even the sick people in the hospital. Even when you're going to travel on the plane, this is, this is very, very uh, convenient for you. You will not find it either in America or around the world. This was given to me by the Holy Spirit to design it. So child of God, get ready to get this. This will be a blessing to you. And then when you do, you are ready to take Holy Communion anywhere in the world. Whether you are farming, whether you are working, you just pull out your box and you just get out your bread. And you said, this is your blood, Father. Bear me and heal me and deliver me in Jesus' mighty name. And then after you do that, you close it. And then you pull out your, the blood of Jesus Christ. So this can serve you three times a day. He said, do this in remembrance of me. Then you left the, the third one. And then after that, you pray and you anoint yourself with oil. And this is going to be a blessing to all of you. And you just put it there and you're ready to run. Please get the Holy Communion um, component and it will be a blessing to you. It is only, don't go for imitations. Just come for the original. 
It is Robert Kanja Ministries, Holy Communion, a mirror that he heals. It's very small, very tidy. You keep it yourself and you pray. And this is a powerful weapon. Get it in the black or white or both. God richly bless.
myself at your feet an offering of gratitude for all you done at Calvary
him touch you today let him feel your soul his blood was shed for you he's in Uh, 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 uh,
Yes. So, Pastor Jbob, the lovely lunch. Yes, let's appreciate them. I don't know where the hospitality into our cooking competitions. So, yes, please. Touch you today. Let him fill your soul. His blood was shed for you. He's in
him touch you today. Let him feel your soul. His blood was shed for you. He's in my new
Jackie B. Born again. Are you born again? 
Come on, somebody shout hallelujah. Good name, Mama, sister. How are you? You are good? I'm cool. When, when, how are you feeling? I'm feeling blessed. I'm feeling best. In best. I'm feeling best. I'm feeling best. Oh, blessed. Yeah? Blessed. And, uh, you're feeling what? Blessed. Blessed, eh? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Oh my God. I saw you praising God. I was like, hey, I need to call her. Yeah? So how crazy can you go for God? Oh my God. Dancing. Yes. Only. Dancing. Only dancing. Okay, what do you want for us to do for you? I can need a scholarship. A scholarship? Yes. Which class? I'm going to join campus. You're what? I'm going to join campus. You're going to join campus? Hey, on the other side, I'm going to Are you sure? Yes. Well, well, how, how many points did you get in Form 6? Not yet. Not yet. I told you again that I'm going to come and see. Yeah? But I thought you, you, go, you, you haven't. She has not done her Form 6 exams and she's saying she wants to go to campus. Yeah. yeah. You finished the examinations? 
Hey, you're ready now in your vacation. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, you never know. I don't know if I'm the one who is supposed to do that. And, uh, but, just where was the was co one in? You never know. For where was I was having, just have this one. Where was was the co? But when it comes through, we all remember her, right? We remember her, right? So the time of scholarship, when it comes through, Eh, hey, oja kuja. Oba ba kwe ngato. Shiba ina kungato hao. Shiba soko jovo zeko kumantu waneno. What's your shoe size? 38. 38. Eh, no nyamuku 38 hao. I think that one must, must fit her. Oh my God. Wana tumuku ilo ugalo wa manye. All right. Uh, in a very special way. I want to say a big shout out to uh, International University of East Africa. Thank you so much for the great giving that you've done for us, for the scholarships that you've given to us. I don't know where Mr. Uh, Jones Jacob is. He's just come and say hello to us. I don't know if he's around, but if Mr. John Jacobs is around, and uh, someone, if you're next to him, let him just come and say hello to us, and then we continue from there. But Immediately after this, we have Pastor Zach is coming through to share with us a very powerful message tonight. And then after that, we continue into the next session, yeah? Uh, someone next to Mr. Jacobs? No? No one? Nobody, right? Yeah. Is he around? Pastor Zach right now is at the basketball court. Hey, I was asking for Mr. Jacobs, the Mr. director Jacob. of International University of East Africa. That one we have to just... Ajatu Wuzeko, or any representative from International University of East Africa, to just come and say hello to us. Hey, Atu Wuzeko, and tell us As about this. As we are school. waiting for Mr. Jacobs. Yes. Uh, right the two now, minutes must be the done. The economic activity that is happening right now is cooking. Hey. We are trying to see people who have cooking Cook. skills. <laughs> Can you be able to prepare a Spanish omelette? Hey. 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 And right now, yes. there is another economic activity happening at the basketball court. Yes, there is a basketball going, going on. basketball going on, but yes. they should be joining us right In now. In a few minutes from now. In a few minutes from now. Yes. They are going to also be having amazing speakers today. We have Pastor Nat. Mm -hmm. We have Pastor Robert Jr. Yes. We have uh, Pastor Robert Kayanjo. Yes. We have Pastor Zach as well. Yes. We have uh, Pastor Eli. Yes. Pastor Eli, right? Mm -hmm. We have Alex Dangote. No, I'm not we a pastor. We have Yeah. But in a special way, yeah. I want us to thank Bango Kicks. Banaye. Now, ladies and gentlemen, these shoes that we have been giving away, the shoes we have been giving come away from downtown, eh. did not come from Chikubo, but they came from one of the most amazing brands, which is Bango Kicks. And you never know, you could be among the people who are going to what? To win. Eh. So the we had someone from IU. Uh, most people were telling me, where do you get those shoes from? IUEA. I <laughs> IUEA. I IUEA. Eh. Eh. Yeah. Now they were asking me, about the shoes. Uh. From day one when we started, Bango Kicks gave us over 34 pairs of shoes Vanange to give out. And I must say, the last two that are remaining, but in a very special way, to Mukumi of Galovamani. Okusubula enga toku vechaina, okuvewa welu sichangu. Sichangu nyo. Sichangu. It's not easy. So you see, when you clap for businesses, God will give you own business and then you start making money. So Mukumi of Galovamani. Uh, we appreciate you, Bango Kicks. We appreciate you very much. Yeah, very, much. You very much. This what size is, is that? This one is uh, 36. What? <laughs> 36. Is there any lady who is here who in has 36. a 36? Uh... This one here. Yeah, there's a Kalito girl there in white. Hey, the, oh, you yeah. are. How you come? You oh, run, around. She's so beautiful. Yeah, very cute. You come running. Come running. <laughs> hey, 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 your combination. Black, white, black, white. Bambi. Ah. Bambi. Let's appreciate her so, one more time, ladies Sarah, and gentlemen. Are we ready? Are Let's we go. Ready? Yeah. Okay, should I come there? 
All right, so let me come. Alex, okay. Okay, you try them out and let's see. Um, before, before you even try out our shoes, I have one question for you. What's your name? My name is a team princess. A team who? Princess. A team princess. You come from Soroti. Where? From Lira. From Lira. A team yeah. You can't speak. I can. We, uh, how, how do they greet? Tengo. Tengo. Eyo. Ay, 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 ay. Yeah, it is my bear. How do you say um into very yo to ja to me a wama way yambali de kunga dozo? Try out your shoes. Shiba, how far talk to me, talk to me. Bana ye mere y de uh huh Spanish omelette is omeletting. Uh -huh. So and as time now uh -huh. to simbula. Which teams are so, there? Mm. So this is how we are going to do it. Okay. We have amazing teams. Uh huh. Ah, amazing teams in bad day. I don't know what is happening to me. I don't know what is happening to me. Mm. The airtime for English is disappearing. <laughs> <laughs> My mind, uh -huh. uh, So like I was saying, we have a team of judges from Contagious. Yes, from Contagious. So what they're going to be doing is that we're going to start from Group A. This was Group A, right? Group A? Group A is here. Okay, we are going to start from Group A here. So we have amazing judges who are going to be telling us if these people in the group A were able to pull it off. All right? So, who are we starting with? Our lovely judge. He's the chef. All right. So, come in, come in, come in. Please open. Open, open. Channel 44, you need to, you need to take this. You need to, you need to show the people this to show the people this. There can be some little music in the background. Yes. Sister, the shoes fit you very well. They fit oh. you. Pakuta no one in the way I'm bad. Round of applause for our team, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, Shiba, how far, how far are we going? But as we're getting ready, uh, I'm going to request the worship team to come on stage because after that we're going to worship God, we're going to praise God and worship Him in one of the craziest ways ever. Yes. Yeah. So now, Group mm. A, we are going to test and see if your Spanish omelette is Spanishing. Let us test. Pola and pola and pola and pola chukwano. Go salangava zungu. Bana. Salango muna you got a wana. For us, we don't joke with daily bread. Yeah? Want you? Uh huh. Oh, you eat it with the tomato. So you also fried the tomato. Eh, hey, so why do you want to? Eat the tomato alone. It's a dessert. I take panayak. Uliaka greedy pepper. It is optional. So what do you think? Um, it's not bad. But I'm here to find out from others. If I give my final conclusion. Oh, your judge yama nyo fumba. Okay. We are in group B. Mm-hmm. Group B, open we see. Let's see how you presented. Eh! Eh! Yeah. <laughs> okay. Even open this one so that we see. Oh, okay. So why are they different? Oh, different. Um, um, what? Omelet. Omelet. Yeah. Okay. Sir. So, you can test. How is this one different from this one? No, they are not so different, but the design. So currently, right now, we are testing Group B's omelette, trying to find out. Mm. Mwani tadamu nechipoli. 
You know, make it African. Make it a Spanish African omelette. Uh huh. What do you think? Oba soko mire chukwan. Chukwe kutuzi. Uh huh. Mm, just one minute. One more minute. Check one two. One more minute. Mm. Now this one. This one tastes like it looks. Like the way it looks, eh? That's how it tastes like this. Oh, so so how does it look? Because you might be saying it just the way it looks, Nayenga, the way it looks according to you. So you see, food uh, should appetize you to eat it. Uh, for this group, I feel compelled to eat this, and it actually tastes a bit like it looks like. So I'm compelled to eat, and it's actually nice. Banda, get soccer group of me. Aha. Okay, so we are going over this side. This side we have group C and group D, right? So where is group C? Group C, you're here. Why? It looks like you're not confident about it. Huh? <laughs> okay, so let's see. Open, open we see, open we see. Okay. So what is this? Spanish one? Omelette. Why does yours look different from the others? Um, the thing is, the, the ingredients differ from the others, and um, we, we put some tomatoes, the, 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 the tomatoes, eh? weren't cooked in, we just cut them like a design, and then we're having some salad there, and this, we, ha we are only having tomatoes, and even we mix them when we are cooking them. Okay, so it's time for testing. Let us see if your omelette tastes the way it looks. Based on your explanations, cut to Dave. Yeah, it actually looks good. Cut to Dave, cut to Dave. Food doctor. It important for us. Important for With grace. Eh. Yes, with the spirit of the Lord. Okay. So these are two different, or you're just, it's just the designs, these two. Both of them are Spanish omelets. Okay. What do you think? This one is okay. Jesus. Now Jesus. this one has a certain taste. Um, that is quite unique Jesus. from what I've eaten Jesus. before. It's an omelet. Jesus. But it has that, um, how do I call it? It's like bluish and it's nice. Uh, I like that. It's something unique about it. And by, by bluish, by bluish, what exactly do you mean? But I don't super glue over. What I mean is uh, when you're eating, you feel, I, I don't know how to explain the feeling, but that's the word that I could call it. Eh? Okay. Okay. So let's go to the last, the last group. This is group D. Yeah. All right, show us what you have, group D. Show us what you have. Show us what you have. Ooh. Show us what you have. Show us what you have. Okay. So which one do you want to go with? First? Start with the other one. I think you need to change. Okay. All right. Let's test and see. Mic check. How does it feel? Mbufiru. Ah, How does it taste? <laughs> let me keep quiet. Let me quick clip. Let me keep quiet. Can see the Let me first test. Just a second. Aladi Mutu, forty four, the best name in television. Tuli wano Kuriot Conference twenty twenty two. Right now. The, acti the economic activity going on is we are cooking a Spanish omelette. So, as Africans, we also know how to cook Western food. So, 
what do you think? Are we, are we ready to go to the World Cup as Uganda? Mm. Let me finish. Can you finish? Finish. finish. Um, so, um, this one is fine, but it's a bit not ready. I feel like uh, there's some bit of. It's not yet ready, like you have not uh, fully. It's just some. Uh, some there are some particles that have not considered the uh, But this one is okay. I love the, so the, the salt. And I love the way you're presenting it. It's really also appetizing and compelling to it. Yes. Okay. We want to re appreciate each and everyone that has been able to participate in this. So I'm going to ask. Um, the chef, the chief chef, riot official, please step forward here, sir. I even don't know how to call it. Should I say sir? Should I say swan swan? Should I say swan swan? I don't know even what to start. So, based on the presentation that you've seen here, hey, it's open. Open. Hey. Open. Who do you think did the very best? Uh, well, first of all, uh, there is what you call sanitation. Sanitation is first. So I'm seeing some, uh, you know, that stuff the quantum. near the food. So uh, that's already yes, yes, yes. one mark chopped. Out of ten, that's one has gone. Fire. So uh, out of ten, and uh, now are you uh, contesting out of nine? Yeah. Is this for group A only, or all of them? See ya. Yes, the Jesus. Entire team. Jesus. Then also uh, the presentation is okay. Yeah, uh, the presentation is good. Both of them, both teams, the presentation is okay. Yeah, it's good. Though I would go with this presentation here. Why? Why would you go with this one? You no. Know, uh, the design, first of all, uh, this is Vinci. You know, a Vinci. Microphone. A Vinci is a cut. And uh, when uh, we are doing salads, you know, it's so painted uh, on the omelets. Julian cut of uh, the green paper. Uh, on the other side, uh, it's called Macedua. So uh, we do not go a lot with it on the omelets. You know, uh, we would always use it. On the other salads, are we eight? Yeah, basically. So I would go with this. So between group A and group B, we are. So group A. Let's hurry, let's hurry, let's hurry, let's hurry, let's hurry. So from this, what do you think? Who is the best between group C and group D in the of interest? As I said again, sanitation is key. So uh, when you look down here, mm. it's dirty. It's no, so again, one mark is gone. So <laughs> are you are contesting out of nine. The guys are losing marks all the time. Eh? <laughs> judge, I will say judge. Are you, are you are contesting out of nine? Uh, when we look at this, you know, uh, it, it got burnt one side, you know. So uh, the other one also got burnt. So again, I would choose uh, this side because of what uh, presentation. But uh, the other guys were the best. So the, from this table, we are choosing group C. So now, wait, you haven't yet won. So now, Chef, in the best. Between group A, judge yani, ania wangu dao, tuwebo we judge, kubanga kati wude te wali, ania wangu de, eh, ania wangu de. Kamenge, eh, first try that side, then we see. Okay. Hey, so now due to time, eh? 
Now, we are out of time. We want just to know. I want to know, who was the chief tester? That is what they do. Hey, the winner, eh? All right, so let's do this quickly. Between group C and group A, who was the winner? I would go with group A. Group A? So group A is the winner. So Alex Dangote, you have their package for them. Hey. Group A, please go to Alex Dangote. Congratulations. And yeah. thank you guys so much for participating. Okay, okay, you can okay. As well eat hey, now you wait for me there. I'm coming over there. I'm coming there. Yeah, you now, ladies and gentlemen, so so in a very much. special way, I want everybody to rise up on your feet. Because now the moment we're going to is a moment of praise and worship, worshiping God. So everybody rise up on your feet right now. Someone make some noise for Jesus. Okay, okay. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody shout, Rayo. So turn to your neighbor a little bit and just wave at them, wave at them. Ask them, are you having fun tonight? So if your neighbor is not having fun, tell them, make sure you have fun because today is the last day. Amen. So let's clap our hands and give God praise. He's worthy. And shout to the Lord with the voice of triumph. Somebody shout to Jesus. Amen. God is good. Jesus, we lift your name on high. Your name on high. Be lifted high. Jesus, we lift your name on high. Your name on high. Be lifted. Let me hear the judge. Jesus said. Lift it up, come on. Believe. One more time, Jesus said. Your name on high. Be Jesus will lift your name. Your name on high. Your name on high. One more time. Jesus will lift your name. Your name on high. Your name on high. Everybody clap your hands now. Smile on your face for the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. Come on, clap your hands. Sing it out. Jesus, we lift your name. Your name on high. Your name on high. Jesus, we lift your name.
get high up up here. Come on. We serve a God who is powerful. Eh? We serve a God who is mighty. Oh. This God is a good God. You can call him a miracle. We serve a God who is powerful. Eh? We serve a God who is mighty. Oh. This God is a good God. You can call him a miracle. We serve a God who is powerful. Eh? We serve a God who is mighty. Oh. This God is a good God. You can call him a miracle. When I look at the things that you have done, when I look at the ways that you have made, how you shower us with your blessings every day, my Papa. I will sing to you the day we shall sing. Yo, come on. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. You say, you can call him a miracle. I serve a God, church, powerful. Eh? We serve a God who is mighty, oh. This God is a good God. You can call him a miracle. We serve a God who is powerful. Eh? We serve a God who is mighty. Oh, this God is a good God. You can call him a miracle. Somebody shout to the Lord. Shout to the Lord. Lift up your voice and say, Creator of the universe. What can't you do? What can't you do, Jesus? Name above every other name. What can't you change? What can't you change, Jesus? Everybody jump now!
your neighbor did you really come here to riot for Jesus hallelujah are you ready one more time to get crazy a little crazier a little crazy for Jesus in this place one more time shout to the Lord with the voice of triumph Say, I have come to give back to you. Jump, 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 jump. I have come say, to say thank you, Lord. Are you grateful tonight? I have come to give back to you. Let's go, say. I have come to say thank you, Lord.
sickness Goodbye to your guilt Goodbye poverty Goodbye to your pain I can hear you say Everybody, everybody shout it out Everybody, everybody shout it out Everybody, everybody shout Let's do this together. Everybody just do like this. Just bend like this. Everybody, everybody. Are you ready? Do you believe God has given you victory tonight? Let's go, let's go. Somebody say, Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Nisi, I am the I can hear you, come on. I've searched around, there's no one else like you. Everything 
Make you put your hand go up. Your name go up and down. Yourself go be a boss. Amen. 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 Everything you put your hand go up. Your name go up and down. Yourself go be a boss. Amen. Amen. Everything you put your hand go up. Your name go up and down. Yourself go be a boss. Amen. Amen. The rich will call you rich. The blessed will call you blessed. The anointed will call you anointed. Amen. Amen. If you believe he say amen. If you believe he say amen. If you believe he say amen. 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 If you believe he say amen. If you believe he say amen. If you believe he say amen. Amen.
I can't hear you. Praise God. Wow. go crazy we're about to go crazy in just a little bit in just a little bit but today while I was praying and we were going through the plan of everything we said you know what for the first time, let the last day of riot be the first day of freedom. You can't hear me. Give me Satchi's mic. Give me Satchi's mic. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Those of you who said no, how are you responding? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I was saying, the last day of riot is the first day of your freedom. Your life will never, ever, ever be the same again today. Very soon we're about to start baptizing people. But before we do, I want to introduce you to somebody. And the person I want to introduce you to, we, I have a lot to say thank you for this man. Because when we began riot, he didn't even call me. But he came and gave us two scholarships to give to you. This is the first time riot has had two scholarships each worth 40 million for you i wanted him i wanted him to come and just briefly say something because this university 
and this man, they don't only love Jesus, but they love you. And they love young people. John Jacobs, if you could please come. today praise the living God I would like to say thank you for being in the right place in the right time I'm John Jacob by names I have been in Miracle Center for the past 20 years for years. I used to train in the Sunday school and I have been through several organizations. I'm a trainer by profession and I train in about, I have trained in 52 universities in Uganda. I have empowered several students. We do a training program called Intelligent Common Sense. To call a training program with Intelligent Common Sense. And I've trained over 300,000 students. Every time I speak to students, I make sure I speak about Jesus. Today, I want to take one minute and tell you something. I am from the International University of East Africa which is in Kansanga, Uganda, the former Didi's World. How many of you know Didi's World? Wonder World. Yes, it is a university now. All right. I believe every student here, we go to school and we go to university. You believe you are going to university not because you have been counting your money. But because you have faith and you believe. All you have to do is never count the money. But count on Jesus. There is a way. Now, why do you go to school? You go to school of course, to learn to make money. Why do, you to, why do you go to university? You go to university for one reason, at the end of the day, to learn to make money. The Bible says, money answers all things. So we must all learn to build skill to get money. I asked someone, why do you go to university? He said, I'm going to university to get a degree. If you have a degree, raise your hand. Why do you lie? Touch your neighbor's neck. Ask him, how, how many degrees are you? Ask your neighbor, are you hot or you're cold? A degree is nothing but a temperature. If I get a jerry can of water, which is, which is dirty, that water must be boiled through 100 degrees Celsius so that it qualifies. Ask your neighbor, are you qualified? Are you qualified? There are many things that qualify you. But the most fundamental thing that must qualify you is first things first. God said it this way. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And he will qualify you. To qualify is to be identified. 
and found fit in the eyes of God first. If you're listening to me, raise your hand. Oh, thank you. All right. So, I am here, I have brought two scholarships from the university. Let me tell you some facts. There are, there are 60 universities in Uganda and only a handful of them are fully certified. To certify is to have something called charter. Kwe kubera ne charter. And the International University of East Africa has a charter which is the highest license given to an organization by the National Council of Higher Education and the President of Uganda. Chata, ye certificate ye weba university obe sume yo na nge iwa weba president wa Uganda nebi ya jigiriza mu Uganda. So when you study here, you or your degree will be recognized globally. Buo sume na waneno, degree ye be e ruka o ne sadida. Let me take two minutes and close down. We have four faculties, the faculty of engineering, the faculty engineer. of uh, science and technology, we technology. have law, we and we have so many other courses. Okay? And our fees are very, very reasonable and so friendly. When you come to our university and you join one week before graduation, you will never uh, hear the professor say, your marks are lost. Or your marks are missing. You are very safe. You will finish what you started. So my spirit decided I must give Robert Kayanja Jr. two scholarships for the wonderful work he's doing. And he's going to choose two of you who will get this scholarship worth ten to twelve thousand dollars each. Nasala won't in no come so much, but Kayan Yolomi Mugakula. Scholarship will be the Dagan and Dabant to Abidi Muma, Abagendo Zua, and Gula is getting Ambuka Danamu Yemu. Thank you very much. Do everything it's it, do everything it takes in life. Kolamu de Chetak Sambula Mu to build your character. That is your qualification number one. Your integrity and your energy. That's your hard work. Education is beyond academics. You need a balance. A balance. You need academics. You also need spiritual qualifications. Are we clear? You see, God has made your body. We are several organs, but we are one body. Academics is one. Knowledge is power. So read books. If you don't have books, read from your neighbor. If you don't like, look at the person seated next to you. If he's looking dull, change your chair. Sit next to someone who is smarter than you. Are you clear? Make sure you're not the smartest in the room. Okay. Do everything it takes for you to be on high demand. Say demand. Tell your neighbor, I am on demand. Tell your neighbor, I am on demand. I am very attractive. What is attractive about you? When people want to associate with you, the first thing they look is not your shoes, not your shirt, not your tie, not your name. They look at your face. And they say, hello, or they run away. Is your neighbor's face attractive? Or what do people see in your face? Girls do a lot of makeup because they want their face to be attractive. Others do their nails. They want their nails to be attractive. What is the most attractive thing about you that makes you like a magnet that makes you get everyone's attention on you. Moses in the Bible was a very old man. He went up the hill. He came down. And people said, my goodness, look at his face. Glory. They knew he was coming from somewhere. 
This is your mountain. This is your leader. This is the right mountain. This is the only mountain in a valley. The Miracle Center Cathedral. Can I clap for the church? By the time you leave this place, people will see confidence in your face. Say confidence. They will see glory. They will pay your fees. They will pay your rent. They will support you because they know you are coming from somewhere. I would like to say thank you very much. God bless your spirit and may your spirit reflect on your face. I hand over the two scholarships worth 40 million shillings and 40 million, 80 million, that's $25,000 worth of scholarships to Robert Kanja Jr. for him to choose the person he believes is right. Thank you very much. They just gave you 80 million and you're sitting down. Hello. Hello. I don't understand the sound people. I came to make noise. They this gave you 80 million and you're sitting down. I'm confused. Eighty million worth of listen, Lida. He just came as uh, and he preached a message. Now we didn't but you people missed it. I didn't miss it. I'm the one person who doesn't miss messages. Let me tell you what I heard. I came to riot and I'm leaving on high demand. If you want to be low demand, you go be low demand. I'm leaving on high demand. Very shortly, miracles will happen. Demons are going to leave. Chains are going to break. And where's Isaac? Isaac? I need Isaac. You see, yesterday, Joe, someone asked me, Robert, can, can you preach a message about chains? I feel like I'm tied to something. This person found me again this morning. Inside church. I was making sure everything comes out. So we're set for being outside. They stopped me and they go, Pastor, please. I have people I came with. There is something on us, please. So I said, but God, you know, today we're going to baptize people. And God reminded me of something. And he said, Even if this message is only for that one person, 
you preach it. Even if the chains only fall off of them, you preach it. You know who you are. The people you came with, who came with chains, you're going home free. And the Bible verse I've been saying every day since riot began. The last part of the verse. Says that he will break your shackles. You see. I. Understand. How people get in chains. And you know, if Isaac is here, you see, Isaac has some chains. Isaac, I need to get his eye now. And if I was to get Dan to come down here, and Isaac, I want you to put this around Dan. Actually, just here. Put it right there. Now you see, whatever. Dan, um, no Dan can go over there. Isaac, go over there. Go there. Now Dan can walk to Isaac. Dan has to Isaac. They can even talk. Give me this. They can even converse. They can be good friends. Baso Baba Mikuano. But Dan has a chain. And Dan has a chain. And the devil is holding it. Do you know what we think of chains? We think that the devil comes and does this. No. But the devil does not use chains like that. The devil uses them on you like you were a dog. He does not care if you and Isaac talk. You know, where's my other chain? Don't touch my things. Imagine that Isaac told Dan, 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 come with me, let's go to church over there. And Isaac takes Dan to church. Dan can go. Dan as Because there's some space. But when he gets far enough that I don't like, I bring him back. You see. Chains that the devil uses were not designed to work like this. The way the devil uses chains on young people is that he wants you to believe you're free. So he'll let you walk. He'll let you talk to people. He'll even let you come to church. But when God begins to move, He pulls you back. He will never ever let you get a breakthrough. And He never ever ever era even tied you up where you were stuck. Let me explain. You can move and have no progress. You can go from level to level. 
and still have a chain. Some of you think real chains are when you're just tied up. Like this. You can't go anywhere. You're stuck. No. This is not it. The devil knows a real prisoner is a person who is in chains but believes they are free. Because God will never free them. Because he's sitting there believing, you know what? I'm free. Rob, this message is not for me. I'm in church. And the funny thing about chains that I learned a while ago was this. Why chains are used? And why they don't use ropes. Is because every chain is just another small chain. The devil is not controlling you with big things. He's controlling you with many small things. And I mean small. They talked about you at school. They chased you and embarrassed you. Your stepmother mistreated you. They said you wouldn't be anything. They add all these chains together. This is where it gets interesting. But the devil made a mistake. He let you come here. The one thing I've seen and I've said all these last two days, now the third day. The reason why we don't get free is this. We don't want people to see this. So he'll hide it. Ah, man, me, I have no chains. I'm free. Because today people are going to get baptized. Some of them demons are going to come out of them in this water. But even though some people will look at them, even the ones they came with, understand, today you're going home free. Even if people around you don't like how you manifested. But tomorrow, tomorrow, when they see you smiling. When they see you dancing. When they see you doing better. When they see you winning and not failing. But this is the most important thing. In the Bible. The Bible there were two men. Taken to prison. 
They put chains on their feet. And then these men began to praise at night. In the dark. It hit midnight. And chains disappeared. The door opened. I am here to declare over your life. That today, not tomorrow, not next week, today, let every chain fall apart. Let every door that was locked be opened. You cannot enter the presence of God and remain the same. It's impossible. Some of you came Mamu. believing God for something. If you came here believing God for something, raise your hand. If you came and you weren't believing God for anything, talk to your neighbor. Ask them what they believe in God for and also raise your hand. Today, trust me. You, what you people, some you young people don't understand. I, I, call, I talk to your parents on Wednesday. Let me tell you what I told them. I said, I only need three days. God only needs three days to fix what has taken you ten years. So, no, Rachel. The, this is the last day of riot. We don't have time to worry about people who will look at our chains. We don't have time to look cute and suffer. This is the last day. Whatever you did not get Thursday, whatever you did not get yesterday, today, you have to leave with it. Look around. Don't look at me. Look around. Look around. Look behind you. Look behind you. Look behind you. If God is going to bless all of these people, do you think he's going to run out of blessings for you? Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Look behind you. Look at all these people. Do you think if God brought you here with all these people, he brought little blessings? If you're seeing all these people who are here to receive something, the same way there are many is the same way God brought many blessings. For you. I, I, there's something I don't understand. Well, just take it. And that's Christians who are also communists. They behave like Jesus only has one blessing per week. Nonsense. The God I serve has a blessing for Monday. In the morning. Monday. In the afternoon. Monday in the evening. Monday at midnight. Tuesday at 7. Tuesday at 8. Tuesday at 8.05. The God I serve has too much.
I don't know why people show up and they think things are going to run out. Me, I'm telling you. Hear it from me. If our God was doing portion control on his miracles, I would not be a Christian because that's not a God. The God we serve, you don't understand. Maybe the people who are serving you food were giving you little. The God we serve, when you bring your hand, He's not looking at how big your hand is. He's just going to take the entire bucket. Let me talk to Dan. The God you serve. There are people who just think that they can only get a little. That's their problem. It's fine. Some of the, these people think that God is only going to do a little. That the miracle that already happened is enough. Some people got their miracle Thursday. Paul. Some people got their miracle Thursday and they think it's over. Some got their miracle Friday. And they say, you know what? God has done everything. I don't think I'm going to get another miracle. The God I serve is not limited by your thinking. That's fine. Let me tell you what our problem is. There was a woman. In the Bible, a prophet comes to her house, her home, and tells her, go borrow many jars. And then the Bible says, the woman came back with a few. I'm sorry, but let me tell you the truth. I am telling you to expect a lot. You brought capacity for a few. That does not limit what is going to come. If you can only carry two, that's your problem. If you can only carry two, that's your problem. But that's not going to stop God from giving you three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one hundred, one hundred and one, one thousand, one million. It will not stop God. Some of you, God told you to start businesses. But then you live your life backwards. If God told you to start a business, even if you have no money, get an account. You're behaving like your pocket is big enough. Sometimes the devil is not fighting you. Your small mind is fighting you blame the devil. Paul, I don't understand these people. Me, I don't get it. I have heard some crazy miracles. No, me, I mean crazy. There's a guy, I kid you not, yesterday I kept telling people about it. They stole his phone and his bag. And in an hour he went home, he had a better phone. One hour. Some people think God takes a week to do miracles. Everyone came to listen to me to preach and riot. Me, I've been learning. Friday, yesterday, 
I learned from a baby. Naize kuva ku mwana muto muwere. Then I learned from a guy who got a better phone after it was stolen. And then I learned from someone who got their school fees paid after the first day of riot. But for you, but pastor, you know, someone has already been so blessed and healed. So, you know, uh, it's, it's a miracle. I don't believe there are any more miracles. If the person you're sitting next to is behaving like that, I'm giving you permission to move. Do not limit what God can do because the bag you brought is small. How many university students? If you go to university, raise your hand. Good, 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 good. 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 If you're renting, raise your hand. Some people, some people missed, missed this Friday night. If you're renting, raise your hand. If, stop. If you're renting and you're still sitting down, there's a problem with you. If you're okay with renting all your life, there's a problem with you. You cannot come to a place where miracles happen and be okay. Where's Paul? Me and Paul understand each other very well. Where's Paul? Uncle Paul. Let, let Paul come here. Me and Paul understand each other very well. Because, because I, I, he's been hearing me properly. They don't understand what renting is. Let me explain. If you are paying someone else so you can have a place to stay, I don't know why you're sitting. Today, and this is what's funny. I saw some of you, are you believing God for miracle? You just sat. You have a home to ask God for. You have a family to ask God for. If you think. Let me, I'm going to change the sermon slightly. The God you see is the God you get. If you believe your God only pays rent, that's the God you get. If you believe your God heals people, brings them out of wheelchairs, that's the God you get. You know what's funny, Paul? Yeah. I saw people. I was like, if you're renting, raise your hand. Some raised their hand. And then the person next to them, their hand wasn't raised, so they put their hand down. Let me tell you, that demon will forever sit on you. Hear me when I am telling you. The thing that blocks all people who love Jesus. They're ashamed to say, God, listen, I came to you today. I'm tired. This is not the life you said. I'm sorry. No one can convince me. Jesus did not die for you to be sick. I had a conversation with these people last night. I know some of you are young. This is going to be a big, big spiritual conversation. A big boy. A big boy spiritual conversation. We had a conversation. I said, Do you know how disrespectful it is for, the, for a demon to even come and sit next to you? How do you allow demons to disrespect you? Some of you came and you're negotiating. Well, you know, 
you know, God, I just need, I just need this leg to be healed. The, the other problems are not so bad. Just work on this. I'll figure out the rest. But let me just pray for this. Because the devil is really holding that. The devil has no right to negotiate with you. Why are you looking? I don't understand these people. But you come in a place, people. I, people won't believe me. I've watched crazy miracles happen. I have seen no leg. Like he has one leg here. No leg here. Another leg grows. But you tell me the devil has a right to come and say, I'm sorry. You're a missionary. This is how missionaries live. Who is the devil to come into your presence when you do God's work? Young people, even if the people at home negotiate with the devil, you will not. I do not allow the devil to disrespect me. If I tell a demon to go, hear me, that thing has to leave. It has no right. When all of you are here, and you go back home, and there was someone there with a the demon, whenever you step home, that demon has to go back to hell. Why? That demon should say, Michael has come back. I need to leave. I'm not, I know the rules. Listen. Satan knows the rules. You don't know the rules. So he's confusing you. The rules are simple. You tell him what to do. He does it. It is not that you have a conversation. The devil is not allowed to talk. Let me tell you something. The reason why the devil cannot keep a home, cannot keep healing, cannot keep anything from you is simple. When Jesus went down to hell, he took the keys. The devil does not even have the keys to his own kingdom. How can he take the keys to your life? I can't with you, Paul. I don't understand. You come here. You bring, bring, bring me the chains. Bring me the chains. Bring. You see, the part of the thing that you missed. Maybe you can't see this far. Put the chain back on. You see, this is what happens. The devil will do this. You want to know why? He can't lock this thing. That's all I just about Kufu. That's first. The reason why he holds it is because he can't lock it. That's all I just about Kufu. He has no keys. All of you were looking at me when I was talking like I'm crazy. The devil has a padlock. But he has no keys. So, 
so what has the devil locked you out of what has he locked you in if he has no keys to close the door what did he lock And in the Bible, there is a scripture. There is a scripture that says, and those in hell are bound and chained. I love the amplified version. Especially because of the language. That scripture said they are chained and held in hell. It just proves my point that the devil can't even lock up the people in hell. He has to hold. He has to hold. Yesterday they were talking about, we, we talked about Job. We talked about Job. Job had to be offered. The devil couldn't even touch him. Listen, listen. How are you afraid of a thing? I'm, I'm tired. You know, Paul, see, we keep saying the devil. Like, that, like it's a title. Like, like as if he's important. No. I, have, I don't need to respect him. Lucifer, 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 Lucifer has to be assisted in disturbing Job. You don't understand. He was assisted. God said, Have you tried him? The devil had to get help and permission. And he's disturbing you without help and permission. How can you There are no chains there that actually have a key or a padlock. The Bible said Jesus has all of them. This gets interesting. We look at the Bible, but we don't read it. If you don't have keys, you cannot lock your home. I'm going to talk to myself because you people are just not understanding. If you have no keys, you cannot lock your If you have no keys, you can't even lock your car. You can't even start it. The Bible was not even specific to how many keys and to what they control or open. It just said the keys of hell. Meaning the devil might even have vehicles that just can't start. But he has the keys to your vehicle. Hello? The man does not have keys for his own kingdom. You're not, they're not ready for me. If, you don't, you don't understand me. If he does not have keys for his own kingdom, does he even own his own kingdom?
The devil. Sidani. The devil. Sidani. Is also renting. Na ye mupangi sa ewe. But but Robert, well, huh, how? Oh, gama, chisa baka chitia. It's the landlord who owns the keys. Landlord ya ine bisimuluzo. If the landlord takes the keys. Landlord wa kujake bisimuluzo. Ani ke bali ba jaka kasimuluzo katoi. If the landlord takes the Paul, I don't understand these people. If the landlord comes and takes the keys. Landlord wa jana kujake bisimuluzo. A house that is not locked is not secure. Which means, if let's say there was a thief who was living in a rented house and everything he stole was in the rented house and then the landlord doesn't come and take the stuff he takes the keys that means if I find where that thief was staying and the thief took my stuff and there's no lock on his door And there's no lock on his door. I'm, I'm done preaching to you. And me, I'm going to preach for myself. And there's no lock on his door. If he was stealing everything. And now the landlord took the keys. Now let me tell you something. You know, I could still go in and get them. So that's not the thing. That's not it. Paul, that's not it. What I'm, what I'm going to say is too difficult for them to understand. Because... If the landlord took the keys and I know the landlord and the landlord is the one who takes care of me and the landlord has the keys to the apartment of the thief if he has the keys Baba and my father Paul is understanding me Paul, Paul, Paul is is getting me. If the landlord is my daddy, you know, you, you know, Paul, 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 Paul. Is the, the sermon is too much for them. I'm not even looking there. Paul, Paul. Whenever you enter a place, you have to sign an agreement between you and the landlord. And if I go tell my daddy, the land, the, the, the tenant, the renter, broke his agreement. He has been stealing from people in the area. And his daddy, he stole from me. You don't understand me. The devil broke his contract. And the landlord is 
me I'm on a stage in my life there's some things I don't even want back I am just going to get him evicted Po, 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 po. It took how many days for Jesus to, to rise? Yes, you are rather not come to Let me tell you something. All of you who are renting and renting happily, you don't want change in your life. There is no outsider who can enter your house and be there for three days unless he owns the place. The devil did not evict Jesus. Jesus left when he was ready. I don't understand why you're suffering. The devil has zero keys. I I know that person asked me to preach about chains. But the thing about chains is that without a padlock and keys, they're useless. You can't even tie anything because you need a padlock to complete the loop. Jesus is so smart. He said, devil, I'll leave you with chains. Because you don't have what it takes anymore to complete the loop. They're not, they have to, I have to show them. He does not have this anymore. To complete the loop. This thing. Jesus left with it. That's why. The devil is holding. You. See, there's some people who want, who want to rent. What they don't understand. Oh, this message is deep and long. But they, do, they, they don't understand. If daddy owns the place where the thief is renting, that means daddy can afford to get me a place where I don't. For, but, but, but before we go there, but, 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 but before we go there, if you're renting and there's a contract, contract, you have to pay rent. Oh, you know, Sasura? Every first day of the month. But you can't so can go that means you know, you know anyone. You are paying. That means you are accountable to them. You have to give account for the place that you're in. The devil is treating you so badly. But he still has to report to Jesus. I don't understand. I don't understand you. No, you people look, but Robert, you know, I don't understand now. The Bible says, God called all his children. Even you didn't go, but the devil went. The man understands the rules. He is sitting here. 
you're sitting embracing your poverty like this embracing your sickness are you How can the devil God calls all his children all of them and the devil comes katonda itati abana ebona bana stand in ajja he arrives natuka and nobody stopped him te wali amugana you want to know why paul why can manya rwachi i'm sorry michael i know you threw me out but I'm still paying rent. I have a right. <laughs> he showed up. The Bible does not recall that he was stopped. Bible but you are having trouble going in and getting your miracle. Nego gendo fune chama gere chere guru chizibu. Omwana. He stand arrived yatuka and proceeded na neyongera yo to go to daddy and begin talking. Na tandika na tukeri tato wafe ne banyumya no kunyumya. The Bible is not talking about anyone else in the meeting going and talking to God. For me, I'm sorry. If I was in that meeting, I would have slapped him. Because that, no, 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 no. Listen, you, wait. Linda. I am talking to God. You will talk after. Even, even, you know, you know. First stop. The story of God is not the story of Job. The story of Job. I read all forty-two, cha- all forty-two chapters. I wanted to slap Job. Because for forty-two chapters, he allowed a guy without keys to take, take. Take at me, me I, I tell people all the time. God is working on me. And the devil knows. That's why the devil if I'm in a place. The devil will be far. Away. The devil will be far away. Because for me, I'm not going to be able to do that. Because for me, I'm not ready to turn the other cheek. Me, you, you slap me, I'll break <laughs> you. I don't understand. For 42 chapters. That's why when people are saying, Robert, make riot a week. I told them God doesn't need that long time. Please. Maybe back then. When they were doing riot. But for me, na yeze. Three days. No. Neda. Miracles happened on Thursday. All of this is just addition. These ones are just getting extra. Why? Ruachi. The Bible verse of this ministry is not in Job. So we don't need 42 days, 42 weeks, 42 years. We only need yesterday, today. No, 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 no. They didn't understand me. Those of you who work here understand. The, the message and Bible verse, the scripture of this ministry is not in the book of Job. It's in Hebrews. It says, yesterday, today, forever. How many days are those? How many days? How many days are those? So far, what happened? 
Yesterday. Hey, yo. Thursday was yesterday. The today happened Friday. The forever. No, poor people aren't hearing me. The forever. The vision of this ministry. The vision of this ministry. Let me tell you, all of you who are here, the vision of this ministry is not you will suffer, 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 and then one day get victory. The vision of this ministry is you show up, you arrive. And trust me when I tell you. No, it's fine. Let demons go. Can why are you, it? listen, why are you surprised? Yesterday, hey, today, Little? forever. Three days. That boy got his phone in three hours. You don't understand. Uh, pe people don't understand. Jesus was in the grave for how long? Yes, your man in Nakumika Mudana sat. Three days. In Nakusatu, yes, your man in Mudana. Three days. Nakusatu. Three days. You don't seem sure. Three days. So what is the problem? If you need 42 days, that's okay. But I'm sorry. I don't have 42 days. The scripture I read has taught me that God can do things. No, 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 no. Stop, stop. You haven't got it yet. The scripture says yesterday, which means he can do something. And then he can do it again. And then he'll do it. Not that it will take him three days. That he will do it for the rest of your life. Now let me finish. We have to baptize people. Let me finish. You still don't get me. You haven't understood the, the, the verse properly. That means if you came here and your past is not right and your past was holding you back, your yesterday was a problem. God can do something to it. And if your today is a problem, God, God Jesus, yes, can do something to it. And, and if you don't know about your forever, if you don't know about forever, David, if you don't know about the forever of your business, Naksa, if you don't know about the forever of your music, music 
if you don't know about the forever of your evangelism God Katonda can do something about it Where's Jordan? Jordan. Where's Jordan? You see, we're, we're, we're going to baptize people. We're going to baptize people. We're going to baptize people. The, the thing about baptism is, is that baptism is not as basic as church religion made it to be. The reason why we said we were going to do baptism and if people don't know me, I, I love the, the head of our missions department, Pastor David. I was like, we're doing baptisms, he got everything set. Baptisms, it's not basic. It's not routine. The point is, you come in as you. Okay, you're not understanding. You come in as yesterday. You get in today. You leave. You, okay, you missed it. You come in yesterday. Yesterday. Today. Jo. Jo, yesterday, today, forever. <laughs> but it was yesterday, Jo, Lero, no Niki Mazi, no Mamma Molito, and I will be now. You come in as yesterday. You come as yesterday. You get baptized, you become of today. You come out of the water as what you will be forever. Oh, Paul, Paul, grab that mic. Grab that mic. Yesterday. Yesterday. Today, today as you're being baptized, when you come out from here, forever, whatever will be. Kubira Yesu Engali Zaman. You come with you yesterday. You come with you yesterday. You get into your today. And you're baptized. By the time you get out. You're forever. You come with your yesterday. Jesus. Jesus. You come with your yesterday. It ends here. Come with your yesterday. By the time you get out. What you will be forever. Jesus. Jesus. 
Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Today is our day. Today is our day. Today is our day. Today is your day. We are going to be baptized. We are going to be baptized today. Jesus, we have been waiting for this. Holy Spirit, this is what we've been waiting for. Since Wednesday. Since Thursday. We need you, Lord. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. This is the day. This is the hour. This is the moment. To fill us. To fill this generation with your presence chains are being broken chains are being removed oh Jesus oh Jesus oh Jesus you're leaving your diseases here you're leaving your poverty here it is no more no more poverty. No more renting. Oh, Holy Spirit. You will not struggle to pay your school fees again. You will not struggle in your business again. You are not going to struggle in your home again. That is his today. The forever of his life. He's entering the forever of his life. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. We love you, Lord. Oh, God. Yes. Jesus, we love you, Jesus. Oh, Reboko Shikataram, Reko Shekete Rebo. Come believing, come believing. You're entering your forever. Sheleboho Sakata, Lekote Reboko Shikata. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Behold, you're entering your forever. You're entering your forever. Oh, Reko Shikata. Lika Pata Reko Shikata. From your yesterday into your today. Ha! Into your forever. Maraka Shikateri. Remove all the earrings. If you have any open wound, first go to the medical tent. They dress you up. Don't enter the water when you have an open wound. You can go to the medical tent. Remove your earrings. Jesus. 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 Oh, 
Ore koshakata Shele poto ribo koshika Leko talabahasi ketele bohoshka Shele po koshikata ha Lebo koshikete rebo koshikata rababa Ribo koshikata rababa People's destinies are being bathed People are being filled with the Holy Ghost Riko pote keshita Ministries are being bathed God given dreams are being bathed. Lebo koshikatapa. Suproshite leba kasindarabaha. Leko te rebo koshikatarabaha. Jesus. 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 He baptized them with water. But Jesus baptized with the Holy Ghost and the fire. We love you, Jesus. Ha. You are holy, Jesus. We love you, we love you, Lord. Love you, Jesus. We worship you, Jesus. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. He's moving. Allow him to touch you. He is moving. He is moving. He is more rabaka shita rabababa. Le babo babo shikata rabababa babababa babababa. Le bababa babababa rebo kushikata rebo kushikata rebo. Se de re de 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 bo kushika. Oh 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 oh. Je de re bro kushikata. The wind of the Holy Ghost. The wind of the Holy Ghost. Ribo koshike te pa, zipata ribo koshika pata ribo, ha? Zoprotele bro koshika ta, mande ribo koshika, zuproshite ribo kozia, labaka ta rabaha, eleko te ribo hosi kata, eleko zika ta rama mama mama mama, mande ribo zika ta raba baba baba baba, reko zika ta raba baba, kam determined. That your life will never remain the same. I will not rent again. I will not beg again. Ribo koshi ketepo. Zuproshete ribaha. Mandare koshi kata. Lekoteleha. Lekotaha zata. Sendeleha daraha zata. Lololoshi talababa. Riko shi keterebohosia. Jesus, Jesus, Lekoshi Prochete Reboko Shika. Love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Please keep your properties, your phones, Rebokoshika. Okay. Bobo inesa woyona Choko jirike wali Then oje mumazi Walwo wa keeping inesa wo Abachala bali abali na Bo aprons They will keep your bag safe Jesus Jesus Ore koshi taraba Leko torebo koshi katapa Sende rebro koshikata Chigwaliro Lembrata raka jete rebo Likata raba kashikata raba Shede rebro koshikata Roblo koshikete rebo koshikata Rababababa Rababababa Ribo koshikata Rababababa Libababababa rebo koshikata Rebo koshikata Those chains are no more 
those chains are no more those chains are no more those chains are no more abachala mukolela ini ya mwe na abasajja mukolela ini ya mwe ladies make your online and gentlemen your online jesus jesus he's here he's here he's here to feel you he's here to touch you he's here to touch you he's here to transform your life he's here to take you to another level oh 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 oh, oh. those nightmares are no more those nightmares are no more oh reko jete reboko shikata the devil has lost a grip over your life. The enemy has lost grip over your life. The enemy has lost conference over your life. Rebo koshi katapa pa 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 ha ha. Reko jete rebro koshi katapa. Zende reko shi kataraba ha. Mataraba baba. Zende rebro koshi ketere baba ha. Riko to posekete repa ha, li kandara ba kosi tere bohosa, zupro si kete repo setere mahanda, zupro kosi kete repo ho. Father, we declare this generation will never remain the same. This generation, we will walk in our destinies. We will walk in our destinies. Makare bokus, mandare bokus, si katara ba ba ba. Lebo sita la ba 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 rebo kozi kata zende rebo kozi kata la ba 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 reko si kata la ba 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 rebo kozi kete rebo kozi kaya zende repro kozi kete rebo hosa reko te rebo kozi kata la ba 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 no more struggles no more struggles no more struggles in your life it stops here it ends here in the name of Jesus. Oh, reboko shika taba baba remo shika. Open heaven, open heaven over your life. Open heaven, open heaven, open heaven. Maka reboko shika ta. When Jesus came out of the river, when he came out of the water, a voice was heard from heaven. Manda reboko shika ta baba baba baba. May heaven speak over you. May the voice of God speak over you. May God speak over you. May God speak over you. May God speak over you. As you come out of that, that water. As you come out of that water. My God, my God. In terebo kosia. Se terebo kose te de pa pa pa. Riko taramande riko zika. Man taraba kose te. Riko to prosika. God of glory, Father of glory, Father of glory. In terebo kozita la ba ba ba, rebo shite posata. Yes, yes, yes. Rebo kozika ta la ba 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 ba. Rebo bo 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 shita la ba 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 ba. Rebo bo 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 ri ma 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 de rebo bo 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 ri ba 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 ba. Mande re 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 bo shita. Zipro shite rebo bo 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 ba. Rebo bo 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 rima mama ni rebo kosi katara baba. Rebo bo 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 rebo kosi katara rebo kosi katara rebo bo bo. Mande rebo si tara baba baba. Rebo rebo si terebo kosi kete pa pa pa. Si prosito rebo bo bo bo. Rebo rebo si terebo kosi kete rebo baba. Rebo mama ni rebo kosi kete rebo baba. Rebo si ta pa 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 pa. Rebo si terebo kosi kata. Oli kosi kopro si terebo. Jesus, 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 oh Jesus, Rebo Koshika Rama Mama 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 Mama, Rebo Koshika Te Rebo Koshika Ta. Okuva kumi yaka kumi neta nono kukawans muje mukore wa nola ine yamu. Fifteen years and below. Miaka kumineta ano kuminena kuminesa tu moje wano sebo abana toba kuata sebo baba gambi baje ba la inige wano fifteen years fourteen thirteen 
eight years makatalaba rekosikete shedere bokosikata bobo mazoku batiza gojoge nda kugalo power office of nekadio baptism kadio nekatalaba Lekota rekoshi kataya, shedere prokoshi katara baha, likoto poshi kata, rekoto poshi kete. Jesus. To sokaba na bato, to sokaba na bato, sokaba na bato. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, behold the young people, the young children, as they come to you for baptism. That you feel them, Lord. You will feel them, Lord. You will touch them, Lord. Reko shakatapa. Manda repro koshi kataya. Zikete repro koshi katarababababa. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. You said in the last days. I shall pour out my spirit upon all flesh, upon your sons and daughters. They are here, my God, that they will prophesy the sons and the daughters of this land. The sons and daughters of this land are here. Ele koze katara ba 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 ba. Ye rebo koshi kata. Manda rebo koshi kata. Riko shikete rebo. Supro shite. Riko shikata. After baptism, Pastor Robert Kayanja is coming. After baptism, still around, Pastor Robert Kayanja is coming, and is gonna release the Holy Ghost. He's gonna release the anointing. Oh my God! Oh my God! Reko zakata paha. Reko zakata raba ba 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 ba. Rebo koshi kete rebo koshi kata. Manda rebo koshi kata. Get your card. If you're done with baptism, sit in your chair. Pastor Robert Kayaja is coming. In the name of Jesus. He will be on this platform any minute from now. My God, Lebokosa, Likata Laba, Rekota Rebokosi Kataya, Manda Rebrokosi Kataraba Baba, Likoto Rebokosi Kataraba Baba, Nibanyi Kiwa Mazi, My God, not sprinkling, Nibanyu Ziwa, Omoyo Mutukuf, Molinia Yes, Rebokosi Kataraba Baba Baba. Manda ribo kushikata, riko topo seke tipo, liko tapa seke te ribo kushikai. Manda ribo kushikata. Don't allow demons to go back with you. Refuse. It ends today. It ends today. In the name of Jesus. No more chains. No more sickness. No more diseases. No more struggling. It stops today. Hey, hey, Reboko Shakatapa, Manda Reboko Shikatapa, Papa, Papa, Reka Taraba Hazianda. Jesus, we love you, Jesus. 
We love you, love you, love you. Oh God. Oh God. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Holy Spirit. We love you, Jesus. Oh, tonight, 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 tonight. now lives are being saved lives are being set free lives are being turned around my friends right now if you hear my voice I want you to repeat after me say anyone who calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved pay close attention my friends you see God is moving in your midst and he is touching your people your friends your brothers, your sisters, your mothers, your aunties, your cousins, your nephews. The Bible says this. Anyone who calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Let's try that one more time. Anyone. You see, I've been around Africa. I've been to Egypt. I've been to Morocco, Tanzania. But I believe Uganda is the pearl. Don't tell the other nations this. But I think you have what it takes to be crazier and louder and more passionate for Jesus. So let's try this again. When I read the scripture, I want you to shout so loud that people can hear you in Nigeria. Anyone who calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. You see, you must know why this is special. You see, Israel at one time was very exclusive to salvation. And you and I, my friend, are not Israelites. You see, the Israelites, they have the prophets, they have the law. They lived on the ground that God came and met Moses on. 
They lived in the vicinity where Jesus took the dirt, spit in it, and put it in the eyes of the blind so they could see. But let me tell you something. Jesus came. Jesus came. Jesus came for you. Jesus came for me. Jesus came for Kenya. Jesus came for Rwanda. Jesus came for South Africa. South Africa. And Jesus came for Uganda. 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 You see, I don't really think you understand. The Bible says anyone who calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved but it doesn't mean everyone is saved no just because you're in Uganda just because you're at Miracle Center Cathedral the epicenter of miracles for Uganda it does not mean you're saved my friends your parents can save you but Jesus saves. Shout hallelujah if this is good news. You see the Bible says you must call. Let me tell you a little bit about calling. You see you have to lift your voice. You have to take out your phone and dial a number. And you must call. And you must call. If you want to get in contact with the one on the other side. Tonight, you are going to call on the name of Jesus. And when you call on the name of Jesus, the blood of Jesus that flows like a river will come and flow into this place right here. You see, it doesn't matter if you're online or you're watching at home. The blood of Jesus will be a mighty river. And it will rush through your television and it will cleanse you from all sin hallelujah 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 you see there was a time when we didn't yet have a savior we were outside of the promises of Israel but one day a man came and when this man came I, I don't know if you know who his name is the, the Bible says he opened the eyes of the blind the Bible says he brought life to the dead the Bible says that his name is you're going to learn something about me this time today. When I want to talk about Jesus, you see that I used to be a crazy football fan. I was the one who would paint my body and I would shout when there was a goal made. But then one day, I met Jesus. And when I met him, football could not give me the kind of cries and praise that my Lord deserves. There was no drugs, no alcohol. Not a sin in the world that would make me shout louder. And tonight Jesus is going to get all the glory. Tonight Jesus is going to get in the praise. You see, when you praise the Lord, the Bible says He inhabits your praise. How many of you are ready for Jesus to come and show up in your life? My friends, go to Jan. You better shout when I'm not speaking. <laughs> Tonight, 
Something has to happen in your heart. You need a real encounter with Jesus. This can't just be church. This can't just be a riot conference. You must meet the maker of heaven and earth. His name. You see, some people in this place don't know his name. What's his name? Shout it out! Shout it out! You see, I live in a place called Florida in the USA. And in this place, Florida, there's water all over the place. And my friends asked me to go to the beach. And so I said, okay, I'll go to the beach. Listen, 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 this, this story is very important. Can I tell you a secret? Why white people go to the beach? <laughs> because we want to have nice tan skin like you. We want to have nice dark skin like you. Look to your neighbor and say, you're beautiful. You see, my friends, they asked me to come to the beach, so I went. And I was really afraid to go into the water. The water was deep. The water was crazy, moving. But they were asking, Zach, come into the water. They were calling out my name, Zach, come into the water. So what do I do? I go into the water. But something began to happen. You see, as I stepped into the water, it began to get a little too deep. And I swam out a little too far. And the power of this ocean began pulling my body away from the shore and safety. Now I had two choices at that time. Say two choices. Say two choices. Two choices. Do you get it? I could either drown or I could call. I could call for help. I could lift my voice. You see, some people don't want to call. They don't want to lift up their voice. They say, I, I'm afraid of that. Then they'll look at me. No, no, no. But my friends, some of you might have been like me and you might even be like that right now. You're drowning in a world of sin. You're drowning in a place of heartbrokenness, of tears and of fears. But there is a name you can call on. My friends, there is a name you can call on. If you call on the name of Jesus, your life will never be the same again. Do you believe it? Shout hallelujah. You see, when you're, when you're drowning in a place like that, just, just trying to get one more breath of air, you don't care what people think. Tonight, you must not care what people think. This is about you and Jesus. This is about you and the Lord. And tonight, when you call on his name, his glorious hand from heaven will reach down into the place of Uganda Kampala. Will take your life and lift you to heaven. Shout hallelujah. You see, the Bible doesn't just say those who are saved are the ones who call. But you must call on a specific name. Do you know what name I'm talking of? If you know the name I'm talking of, give a mighty shout.
You see, Rabba. I don't know if you remember as we were going through this riot conference, which I'm so privileged to be a part of. Greatly honor all of the Kayanjas. But they will tell you themselves. The greatness does not come from the last name. But the greatness comes from a man. This man who is God. This man who died on the cross. His name was different. You see, his name, it caused the very demons to cry out. You see, his name caused such a disruption in the world that even today, all of the greatest minds study him. You see, Jesus yes. is like no other. And in this story that I'm going to share with you over these next few minutes, it's really going to bless you. It is the story of a man named Blind Barnabas. You see, Blind Barnabas was hopeless. He was probably left behind by his family. He was definitely left behind by his friends. And you see, blind Bartimaeus, he was in this place where actually he was on the street corner and he would have to beg. And so for people like this in this day and age, what they would do is they would give a coat to individuals who were handicapped. You see, the city the time it had labeled him that coat on his back wasn't just permission to beg but it was the devil speaking over his life saying you are hopeless you will never find help but something began to happen in this man's heart do you remember the story Jesus is passing by he hears about it he has no one to take him to Jesus so all he can do is cry out all he can do is call I'm here tonight to tell you if all you can do is call on the Lord it will do wonders for you blind Bartimaeus hears Jesus and he cries out Jesus Son of David Jesus Yesu Jesus Yesu Jesus Yesu Jesus Yesu Do what no one else can My friends Jesus can never pass by a cry towards him. He will stop for every broken person. And he will work miracles in your life. Say hallelujah. You see, Jesus can never pass a person drowning. You must cry out. No whispers here. You must cry out. You must cry out to Jesus tonight. No matter how difficult or your pain is. Jesus can change it all. You see. How many of you. Want to call on the name of Jesus tonight. Lift up a shout to heaven. Say me. Hallelujah, hallelujah hallelujah my friends tonight when you call on the name of Jesus it will bless you but let me tell you what it means to call on the name of the Lord you see the Bible says you can only serve one master but you will love one and you will not like the other 
When you say yes to Jesus, it means saying no to stealing. It means it means saying no to being disobedient. It means saying no to seeking a life for yourself. You see, what is this, my friends? This is a wedding ring. Do you know what this means, my friends? This wedding ring means this that I have chosen one and I've said no to every other. Tonight, when you call on the name of Jesus, you must say yes to him with all of your heart, with all of your mind, with all of your strength. You see, tonight, I believe that a rope is being given to you. You say, Zach, the waves are coming over my head. I can barely breathe. I need deliverance. I need a miracle. I need saving. I need the power of God to touch my life. You see, in just a few seconds, you are going to call in the name of the Lord. There is a rope coming down from heaven. And Jesus is saying, if you can reach out and touch it, if you can reach out and touch it, he will take you into the mansion, into his plan, into his will, and into his arms. Tonight, across this place, if you do not know where you would go if you were to die right now, if you do not know if heaven is your home, I ask you to lift your hands high. Tonight, we're going to call in the name of Jesus. Tonight, the hands that save, the hands that hung on the cross are going to save you. If I could just have everyone stand for this. Place. Just everyone stand across this place. Please, 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 please. We stand for the queen. Can we stand for Jesus? Tonight. No matter what the devil has planned, it shall be canceled in Jesus' name. Every single warfare shall be shot down out of the sky. God will pull down the pleasant devil's plans, and you will step into the blessingness of God. My friends, Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready back there? Are you ready neighbors that hear my voice? God is speaking to you tonight at home. Are you ready? This is your moment. This is the time. You shall call on the name of the Lord and your life will never be the same again. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Now when you say this, you're, you're about to repeat something. I'm going to lead you through a prayer. If you really mean it's in your heart, I want you to say it with all of your guts, all of your strength. I want you to make the devil shake in hell tonight because he can no longer hold you with chains hallelujah hallelujah say this after me dear Lord Jesus Right now, I ask you, Lord, to save me. I'm sorry for straying away. Right now, Jesus, 
I call on your name. Go Wash me in your blood. I believe in my heart. And I say with my mouth, you are the Son of God. And you have the power to say. Save me now! Wash me, Jesus! Naza Yesu! In Jesus' name! I believe it. I receive it. In the name of Jesus Christ. Everyone shout hallelujah. My friends, I must tell you there's another gift that Jesus wants you to have tonight. You see, he gives us the gift of salvation. If you have called on his name tonight, I want to be the first to say welcome to the family. You are a child of God. The devil, ha! Ah, you are off limits to all of hell. You are off limits to all of hell. The second gift he wants to give you tonight is the gift of the Holy Spirit. How many of you want this precious gift tonight? My friends, let me tell you about this gift. The gift of the Holy Spirit gives you power. Say power. Yeah. Hey. Power over hell. Power over being broke. Power to share the gospel. Power to change the world. My friends, I must tell you, if you want this gift, there's something you must know. If you want to receive this gift, you must do two things. Say two things. Say two things. First, you must have Jesus living in your heart. You must be a child of God. You must be saved. How many of you are saved tonight? Let me see your hands. If you are saved tonight, hallelujah. 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 Well, the second thing, my friends, is you must ask. It's as simple as this. How many of you are ready to ask for the Holy Spirit? Yes, yes, yes. I, I don't know. I think Tanzania is a little more hungry than you. But brother, brother, I think Tanzania is a little more hungry. I said, how many of you are ready to receive the gift of the Holy Spirit? It's a little bit better. Right now, something is about to take place in your life. I want you to do this. Every eye closed in this place. Every eye closed, every head bowed. We're giving reverence to the Holy Spirit. Lift up your hands to heaven. Like you are about to receive a gift. Right now in the name of Jesus. I pray for every single person in here. 
Father, break every stronghold. Break every power of their life. Set them free, God. And tonight, give them boldness. Give them your spirit. Fill them like never before. Now, I want you to say this with me. Say this, say it. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit, come. Just begin crying that out. Cry out. Say, Holy Spirit, come. Lift up your voice. Cry out. Holy Spirit, come. 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 Moyo mutukufu jangu. Moyo mutukufu jangu. Sigala go kola. Sigala go mita. Keep calling on him. Keep asking him to come. Don't stop calling on him. Stir yourself up. Moyo mutukufu jangu. Stir yourself up. Cry out. Holy Spirit, cry out. Don't look to the one on the left or the right. Right now, in the name of Jesus, come, Holy Spirit. Now, shh, 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 shh. just lift your hands to heaven and receive. right there. Don't quench the Holy Spirit. Don't offend him tonight. Press into his presence. Right now, if you have the gift of tongues, just begin crying out and praying in tongues. Pray in tongues. Pray in tongues. Pray in tongues. People are being filled right now. People are being filled right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Shout hallelujah ten times. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Right now, sickness is leaving your body. There is an illness in your blood. 
It has ruined your blood. It has made you hopeless. It has made you hopeless. Right now we speak to HIV. We speak to AIDS. In Jesus name. Fire of God. Touch Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Miracles are all over this place. Are all over this place. Tonight is a night of blessings, freedom, and glory. The God we serve. is doing miracle signs and wonders. Even before people get into the water, I pray that God begins the transformation process over your life. I pray by the time you get there, it's just the 10% left. Because the God we serve is good, he's powerful, he's almighty, and he doesn't make mistakes. Jesus, we thank you for this harvest. 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 If you're in the crowd, if you're there and you're looking and you say, you know what? I really didn't bring clothes. But Robert, I, I, I don't care if they see me wet. I yes. need to experience Jesus. It's okay, you can come. If you're saying, God, I still need you to change me. It's okay, you can come. If you need freedom, it's okay, you can come. As demons are leaving people and transformation is taking place in their lives. So shall it be in your life. All the people in the lines from here all the way to there I decree that today you're walking into forever. You're walking into forever. You're walking into a blessing. You're walking into a miracle. Because you understand this. The devil has no keys to lock you up. You're free. You're blessed. The moment you enter that water, what God is going to do will be like nothing anybody has ever done and seen in your life. Jesus, we thank you. 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 If you're in the line and you're sick and you're not well, touch where you're sick. Touch where you're sick. If you're sitting in the crowd and you didn't even intend to get baptized, but you're sick, touch where you're sick. Touch where something's wrong. Even if you need to grab your wallet and hold it up. Grab it and hold it up. I'm telling you, today is the day of complete freedom. Complete deliverance. Devil, I command you to leave. By the authority granted to me by Jesus. You have no place here. You have no right to hold people. You have no right to touch people. These people are free. They're blessed. Today they're walking into their forever. Jesus gave this ministry a mission statement. In that mission statement, He is the same God yesterday, today, and forever. And that same God of yesterday, today, and forever is going to heal them the same way He healed people yesterday. The same way He healed people today. It's the same way He 
he's going to heal them forever. Devil, you have no place here. Devil, you've been evicted. You have no keys. You broke your contract. Get out and leave them alone. We pray healing over you. Deliverance over you. We serve a God who has never failed, who has never made mistakes, who was never late. He is always on time. We serve a God we can't even fully explain. We don't have the words for how good he is. We don't have the words for how much he can bless us. That's how good our God is. And Jesus, we thank you. We thank you for your here. You're here touching people. You're here ministering to them. You're here transforming lives. Because God, you're so faithful. You're so faithful and so, so good. Your word is everything. Your word is everything. Your word is everything. And God, we thank you. We thank you because we know you won't fail. We know you won't make a mistake. We know you won't be late. We know, we know you're so, so good. And God, you're amazing. You are amazing. You are amazing. Oh, Jesus, we thank you. Yes, we we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Oh, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Jesus, we thank you. Jesus, we love you. Yes, to Kwagara. Jesus, you're amazing. Yes, we will you say. 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 Jesus, I'm gonna tell the people who are praying. This prayer team. Don't pray in a circle as that water is being added go lay hands on them leave here and go lay hands on them go lay hands on them don't pray amongst yourselves we didn't come here to pray for each other we come here to pray for them they journeyed here so transformation is going to take place. Go all the way. Go all the way and touch every person. Go all the way and touch every person. But by the time they get here, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus is going to complete what he started. He's going to finish what he started. He's going to finish what he started. He's going to finish what he started. Finish what he started. Oh God, I love you. God, you're so, so good. You're so, so faithful. You know what you're doing. You know how you're doing. You know how you're ministering. You know how you're going to bless them. Because you're faithful. And you're good. And we love you. And we love you. And we love you. You're so, so good, Father. You are so, so good, Father. You're so, so good, Father. You're so, so good, Father. Oh, we thank you, Father. We thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Oh, Jesus. Ribro jodododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododododod
let us let us continue praying let us continue ministering the holy spirit is all over this place the glory of god is everywhere and god is touching people healing people ministering to people in jesus mighty name so let's start praising god in Jesus' name, as God is touching you, the Holy Spirit is moving, is doing great and mighty things. In Jesus' mighty name, God is touching your life. In the days of, uh, of the old, the Lord was doing great and mighty things through baptism the children of Israel went through the wilderness this is one of the greatest things from the days of the Bible to the days of John the Baptist right now we see the Lord is doing great and mighty things the Lord is establishing his plan he's doing incredible stuff in Jesus mighty name he is mighty he's powerful Continue to pray. Continue to believe God. Continue to acknowledge His presence. His power is here. In Jesus' name. You are leaving your sickness in that pond. In that pool. You are leaving your poverty. Your lack. Your situation. In fact, to, for you, this is the beginning of a new year. God is giving you a new beginning. God is giving you a new start in Jesus mighty name and even those of you have been baptized or you came to watch your children get baptized for the glory of God just get ready to the spirit of a living God in Jesus mighty name I know his spirit is here I know the work is here I'm here to lead you into, into the baptism of the Holy Spirit so and the anointing many of you are living here heavily anointed by the power of God. Heavily anointed by the Spirit of God. You will be the head of your class next year. In Jesus' mighty name. By the power of the Holy Spirit. God is going to touch you. God is going to bless you. God is going to increase you. God is going to minister to you. And believe God for great and mighty things. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. To God be the glory. All the choir is singing the song of the spirit songs of worship what is such what is what was the worshipers in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Spirit God is going to touch you the Lord is going to minister to you the Lord is going to pour his grace upon you and he's doing miracle things in Jesus name wherever you are if you have ever longed for the Holy Ghost just those of you who are being baptized lift your hand just say Lord Holy Spirit I need you Holy Spirit I need you right now I need you in my life I need I need you in my life. Holy Spirit, I need you in my life. In Jesus' mighty name. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Say, I need you, Holy Spirit. Right now. Right now. Right now. I need you, Holy Spirit. Touch me. Fill me. Use me. Anoint me. By the grace of God. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. These are like the days of all. And I believe the Lord is going to touch and bless and minister to everyone. In Jesus' name. It is over. The witchcraft is over. Hell is over. Poverty is over. Diseases are over. Lack is over. Doors are opening for you. You are peculiar people. You are a royal priesthood. You are a holy nation. The Lord is with you. The favor of God is with you. The power of God is with you. The spirit of God is with you. You will never be the same again. His grace is sufficient. No more demons. That's why they are screaming. That's why they can't stand the water of the Holy Spirit. They are living forever. They are living 
forever. And if somebody bewitched you, it is over today. If someone sabotages you, it is over today. If you have been failing, failure is over. If there have been any situation, it is over. God is with you. The Spirit of God is with you. The anointing of God is with you. Move in the power of his might in the name of Jesus. You will never, 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 never be the same again. The Spirit of the Lord is moving. This is powerful. This is powerful. They are putting in more water. They are putting in more water. In Jesus' mighty name. A child of God. God is good. Because many people have been baptized in that water. Now the, 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 the scientists are testing that water. To make sure that there is nothing harmful to you. So that delay as they are putting in more new water. Because we care about you. We care about you. You. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. That's why you find these demons are leaving the people. Bandages breaking. In Jesus' mighty name. To God be the glory. Nothing like this has ever happened. And it continues to happen. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Master. Thank you, King of Kings. And Lord of Lords. We still have more cameras. Somebody can get some cameras in channel 44 and bring them over here in Jesus' mighty name. Because the activities that are happening here need more than one camera or two cameras or three cameras. So let the cameramen who are over there, somebody rush and get them in Jesus' mighty name. The power of the Holy Spirit. This is revival. This is prophetic. This is the anointing of the Holy Spirit. Spirit. This is what was spoken of by Prophet Joel that in the last days I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh and your sons and daughters. Those of you got your smartphone, pull them out and then just, just record whatever God is doing here in the mighty name of Jesus because God is good and He's working and He's doing wonders and He's doing miracles and is establishing his plan. So believe God. Trust in the Lord. Acknowledge the Lord. His presence is here. His anointing is here. His grace is sufficient. His power is everywhere. Somebody shout hallelujah. This is the best Christmas gift you have ever received. We rejoice with you. And I'm telling you, you're going to be filled with the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' mighty name, by the grace of God, by the power of God, let God do something wonderful in your life. In Jesus' mighty name, His Spirit is incredible. His power is everywhere. In Jesus' mighty name, come on, choir. Come on, where is Sachi? In Jesus' name, come on, sing a song of the Spirit. Songs of worship. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. We give you praise, we give you praise. We give you praise, we give you praise. He's the Alpha and Omega. He's mighty God, he's everlasting Father. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. So let your living water flow over my soul. Let your Holy Spirit come and take. That has troubled my mind All my cares and burdens Unto you I walk Let your living water Flow over my soul Let your Holy Spirit Come and take control Every situation that I saw on my mind, all my cares and 
is the year of a mighty move of God. And it has begun with you, young people. It has begun with you, children of God. You are the future of this land. You are the future of this nation. So God is anointing you. Don't take it lightly. Start speaking in tongues. As the Holy Ghost is giving you utterance. As the Spirit of God is moving. Come on, just talk and speak in tongues. Just glorify God. Come on, young people. Come on, young people. This is your time. This is your time. This is your hour. This is your day. This is your moment. This is your spirit. This is your space. This is your space. As I see lines upon lines, they are still out there. After one hour and a half of baptism, the lines are just growing. The line is just expanding. This is revival. This was what was spoken of by Prophet Joel. That in the last days, I will pour out my spirit. Oh, it is here. It is here, young people. Rejoice. 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 For your Lord has come. For your God has come. For the presence of God is here. For the Lord will do great and mighty things. There is a fresh anointing of success, of increase, of, of prosperity, of wisdom, of intelligence that is taking place in the name of Jesus. Mighty God, mighty God. Tanks upon tanks of water. Tanks upon tanks of water is coming. They are putting in and putting in. And it's getting get out and it's putting in. It's put, they're putting in and putting in. That is the sign that God is going to pour out His Spirit upon your life. Measure by measure. Power by power. Level by level. Anointing by anointing. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Get ready. You will never be the same again. You will never be the same again. You are the head and on the tail. I bless your families. I bless your siblings. I bless your countries. I bless your generation. I bless you. I release the favor, the anointing and power. Oh, the cloud of his glory. The cloud of his glory. In the name of Jesus, the cloud of his glory is descending on you. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. You will never be broke again. You will never suffer consequences. Sin is defeated. Witchcraft is overpowered. Satan is finished. The glory of God is on you. This is your day. This is your time. This is your hour. This is the time. The spirit is moving. The spirit is moving. Hallelujah. Glory, glory. You are standing on the holy ground. The spirit of the Lord is moving on you. Oh, I pray for you. Today is your day. Today is your hour. Even those of you watching by television, even those of you at home, if Mama, Papa, you have a car and your children are not baptized, get him in the car. Put them in the vehicle. Damn, here come here the miracle center. Baptism is still going on. It doesn't matter whether we reach midnight. This is how revival starts. Whether you're a believer and you've never been baptized, it begins with children. Get in your car. Get on your border, border and come here. Baptism will go on. Will go on until midnight. So come and be baptized in the season of Christmas 2022 by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus. Why should you just watch? You in the neighborhood who are believers. You've been suffering the whole of this year. Come on, come down here at the miracle center. In the name of Jesus. 
Jesus. This is riot conference. The righteous invasion of truth has come in the land again. So get in your car. I order you by the masses of God. Bring your children. Bring yourself. Come here and be baptized. Why should you sit in your house on Saturday enjoying pork? Get over here. Be baptized. Be filled with the Holy Ghost. Everywhere you go, young people are praying. Those who have been touched by God. Others are crying. Others are laughing. Others are praising God. Others are repenting. Water is being poured in. Tank by tank. Come on, bring that camera over here. I don't know where you have been hiding. Stay on the stage. The tide has changed. Look in that into the into the pool. Put your camera in that pool. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God. By the grace of God, it takes a whole a whole ten thousand liters to fill this portable baptismal pool in the name of Jesus hallelujah hallelujah hallelujah, hallelujah. teams of experts are here testing the water the HP in the water because they want you to be to be healthy so wherever you are Miracle Center members you are sitting at home stop wishing right here right now Get on the border border. Get on your car. Get on everything you have. Come over here. In the name of Jesus. The baptizers are here. In the days of Jesus, it was only John the Baptist. But today, hallelujah, thousands of thousands are baptizing. Baptize. Baptize. In the name Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus the son of the living God baptize baptize the spirit of the Lord is moving the spirit of God is moving somebody need to jump with a camera need to jump on this water tank somebody with a good camera get on the water tank get on the water tank no yeah you you don't you, don't you, you stay here, you stay here. You stay, here. you get on that water tank. In the name of Jesus, it is happening. Young people, this is your moment. I said, this is your moment. I said, this is your time. I said, this is your moment. This is your time. Okay, this is your hour. You are not just getting in the water. You are getting in revival. You are getting in the power. You are getting in the spirit. You are getting in the joy. The Lord is going to fill you. Yes, it has taken long. Get over here. Fill me that place all over the place. People are still in line. Zoom it all the way from there. People are still waiting. So start laughing. Now we're water again. Now we're Rejoice! 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 Rejo
international waters. It is international waters. In the name of Jesus, I'm telling you, you are the most blessed young people. Some of us were baptized in the lake, others in the river, others in that swimming pool. You are being baptized with several anointings, international waters. Yeah, you travel nations. You will be you will possess nations. I prophesy. There will be no lack in your life. I prophesy. There will be no disease in your home. I prophesy. You will never suffer. In the name of Jesus. Just rejoice. Just rejoice. Just rejoice. Those who are being baptized are being delivered from demonic activity. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, rejoice as they are baptizing you. As they are baptizing you, you are receiving fire. Even the mamas have come. Even papas are coming. If you're still home, border, border. If you are within Rubaga, Govera Kabusu, you are in Kabusu, Godimuro Kore, you are safe, Kobatisi Wanga, never been baptized, Shidiba Shayo Kanon, but it's a Chiriwano Kumira Kosena, Pulo Yoda Baptist, and Pulo Kosena, Yasuna Jana Baptist, when Jesus came and was born, Yayo, if you are there, Olimo Kirisa, you are believing, Kobatisi Wanga, you never been baptized, Tino Moya Yashi Kose, the host me doing this, Linya Boda, get a Boda, Yangua, 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 Yamba, get down here, Yangua. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the Living God, by the power of the Holy Ghost, they are bringing in more water. They are bringing in more water. The trucks are moving. Jesus, the Son of the Living God, they are bringing him more water. Somebody shout hallelujah! Somebody shout hallelujah! Revival is here! Revival is here! Hey, come on, Robert, come here! Revival is here! This is revival! Who would thought that with that the revival will break? In the riot conference, who so? Nobody. Nobody. Nobody thought. They are bringing him more water. That is a sad truck. They are bringing him more water. No one thought that this would be able to happen with young people. Everyone thought that revival would be when all the old people were here. I'm here to tell you they were wrong. Revival is already happening. You're standing in the feet of John the Baptist. If you're still home, they're bringing more water. They're going to baptize you. Duka. Run here. Quarter border, 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 Park border, border. Uber. You get, get your Uber. Uber. Funa Uber. Get your taxi. Bansata. Get your vehicle. Put your family in there. You leave the security. The rest go. When you come back, the one Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. 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 This is the river of life. This is the river. There's a song called Rivers of Life. You know, wash yourself in the river. You know the song? It's an old revival song. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Watch yourself in the blood of Jesus. People are still coming. I see people moving. Cameraman, get that people. Get that people. They are walking in. People have just arrived. They are getting in the line. They are getting in the line. They are getting in the line. In the, line. In the name of Jesus. All I want is the people who are coming in. Put your camera, your lens 
over here, people are coming through here. In the name of Jesus, people are just arriving. Yeah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Revival is here. Revival is here.
sure the revival begins with all the people. But it has begun with you. This is incredible. This is powerful. This is full of power. In the name of Jesus. God is going to do great things. Do you feel the anointing? I said, do you feel the anointing? I want you to play that, that, that verse. Play that verse again.
off, cut it off. Get it. Cut you another man, I am Remove your religion, get it. And these young people, you know, because that's how.
now they have come with. What you were saying? They, 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 they've just taken off their shirts to get baptized. In the days of John the Baptist, they were not changing rooms. It was a desert. People came with their clothes and they were baptized with their clothes. In the name of Jesus, this is revival. These are the people we've been calling on. And they've just come as they are. You understand? They've come as they are. Yes, they want to. So they have to be baptized as they are. And it's after they will have something dry. Yeah. This is revival.
Zivali Nechitu. Yave Babda is coming. Nidia Batiriso. Nidia Baita Batiriso. This is called the Babda. Singa de Tuabanganako. Not the one we are. Nidia Batiriso. This is the real baptism place. Wale Kemi Korojo. Lift your hands up. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, to Charlie Day. You visited us. Don't leave here today. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, to Charlie Day. You visited us. In the name of Jesus. They will fill us with your spirit. I you people are just arriving. In the name of Jesus. If you're here around Miracle Center. You've just arrived. Come quickly. Come quickly before we close. It's been over three hours of baptizing people. In the name of Jesus, sorry. Tomorrow is service. We are starting at six in the morning. Six a.m. will be here. At two a.m. At ten a.m. At twelve p.m. People are just arriving. Baba no bakatuka. People are coming right now. In the name of Jesus. God is doing mighty things. Baba bajira kuboda. They are coming on border borders. Bajira kumotoka. They are coming in cars. Boya katuka yangua. If you just arrived, come fast. Baba isokubanga kwe face send by you. You may be the last face. In the name of Jesus. Who would thought that this service will end like this? The service ena kumweti. Only the Holy Ghost. Omemu dukubu yeka. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The young man has just come. The young lady has just come. And the young lady has just come. Another one has just come. She has come out of the saloon. They have just done her hair. Maybe she was home. In the name of Jesus, people are just arriving. Hurry up if you just come. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible says they came and were baptized. The Baptists. This one came with that daughter. Nobody remains. In the name of Jesus. Run quickly and be baptized. This is international water. There are those of Switzerland. Ukraine. Those from Ukraine. Germany. One from Germany. One from America. One from Rwanda. Uganda. Those of Uganda. They are Congolese in the water. They are Kenyans in the water. All kinds of people in the water. Even the Sudanese are here. This is international water. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Even such as been baptized today. It's not a joke. In the name of Jesus. You come. Get in the water. Get in the water. This one has also just come. People are getting saved now. They get saved, get baptized. The Bible says, whoever gets saved, this one will be baptized. Who believes and is baptized. If you believe and you're baptized, you'll be saved. Five minutes remaining. If you just come, come running. We are about to finish. Come running. Come running. They are just arriving. That's what I told you. Revival is everywhere. Mama, just come. Mama, just arrived. There is a mama who has just arrived. It is boiling hot. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mama who Run has come also. If you just come, come running. Even a young man has come. You're going to see people get saved. Uganda is on fire for Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The old mama has just arrived. Mama, we are to say. With the grand. 
back son hallelujah no no he akatuka another one has also come abada zuba zuba huyo he akatuka scabby was delayed molinya ya yesu in the name of jesus hallelujah hallelujah oh no no he akatuka another one has come molinya ya yesu people arriving aboruganda brothers and sisters if you're talking of revival revive anyone oh revival is here in Jesus name hallelujah ne mama uno na yeye akatuka ana mama aska uno akatusa zena suka she has come with a bed sheet bible they have a yokeranga that's what the bible says tina baje kuvamba sirikale they came out of the sera bya yokana the days of john abantu bakatuka people just arriving uno na yeye akavamu katare this one is out of the market uno atushe just come hallelujah hallelujah she has just come from the marketplace there she is huyo bakatuka babo bajira kuboda they are coming on boda boda is arriving we are calling you on a chicken yangu if you just come come running garamanzi gali international international baptism water hallelujah hallelujah woka na hallelujah mirudi habiri mugumu shout hallelujah 21 times hey
Jesus is Lord. Yes, ye mukama. Jesus is Lord. Yes, ye mukama. Ne mama uno na yatu se. Another mama has come. Oh ya oh oh oh. Arabi kafude na natete. Maybe she's from natete. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. She's come to get baptized. And the husband is here. Oh, yeah, the color of Another one from the color. Love Lama. your hearts for Jesus. In Jesus' name. Hey, hallelujah. 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 Listen. Listen. On the 31st, Christmas we are here, of course, 24th. All the service for the youth is going to be here. Come service don't, don't, be don't, don't go wrong on me. Don't get wrong on me, please. So on the 31st, we are here. But we are starting with baptism. We are starting with baptism. On the 31st, we have mochomo. We have all kinds of stuff. We have food. We have everything. As we enter the new year. But those of you watching by TV. You are not baptized. We are going to start at 9. Even if you are not saved. You come. You get saved on that day. And come from everywhere. We are going to baptize you. The Bible says. He who believes. And is baptized. Eyes shall be saved. Even mama just arrived. She has just arrived. People are getting saved. Jesus commanded to preach the gospel. He's coming back quickly. So no reason for that case. On the 31st, to turn the sun from in the morning. To get the red dark We we'll go till evening. To eat an angel to be fireworks. We'll even be at night and blow fireworks. It is gonna be great. Na yebo ni joko sata first one. Every 31st here. We are always outside. In our 25 acre ground. Zona zijula. They all get filled up. So jangu ngabu chali. Come early on 31st. That you may get a place. Umu kama jaku kolele miku. The Lord will do you mighty things. Saturday, Next Saturday is for the youth. It's gonna, we're gonna have a Christmas party. We're gonna have a Christmas party. That is called Never Sea. Sawa I starting at Muri, eh, I need is a Jesus. To welcome Jesus Monsi. to the world. Even other mamas have just arrived. I've told you the spirit is here. Wachitaro. He's mighty here. Wamanyi. The Holy Spirit is here, mighty. Nobody's not going to get baptized. Hallelujah. 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 The Holy Spirit already visited here. When he comes to me, he won't leave me the same. The anointing is slaying people down. Yes, Jesus is upon the people. Take all those who have not been baptized. Ask your neighbor, are you baptized? Ask your neighbor, are you baptized when you believed? If they're not baptized yet, take them to the baptism pool. Let them get baptized. If you take them all, you'll also be baptized the second time. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Another one has just arrived. No, 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 Others have just come. Thank you, Jesus. Clap your hands for Jesus. Sister, now again, another one has been brought. You go so. In Jesus' name. Yeah. Get in, step in the basin. You also get baptized. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, our God. Hallelujah. 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 I want to thank God for Robert Pastor Naksa and the entire youth ministry. I want to thank Pastor David and the whole mission team. I want to thank our ushers, our ministers. 
every department, every department. Hospitality, hospitality you've been feeding us we want to thank you we want to thank all of you our guest speakers from all over the world thank you for coming and also participating in the baptism in Jesus name I know the Holy Ghost I after they baptize, I'm going to ask these men of God if someone can put up some cavera here because I wanted to ask them some question. Or if not, somebody take a microphone to them in the baptism. In the baptist, uh, in the baptist tray. <laughs> yeah, take, take a microphone in the baptist tray so that I can ask them some question in Jesus name yes pastor from Ukraine I know you come from a, a, a very religious country but have you ever seen anything like this no I have never seen anything before but I truly believe this is just the beginning all around the world. Amen. Pastor from uh, Pastor from uh, Germany. Pastor from Germany. Yeah. Have you ever seen anything like this? Nine emails. No, never. Ich, ich bin total glücklich, dass ich sowas auch in, in Deutschland sehen werde. Dafür bete ich. I'm praying to see the same in Germany. Amen. Hallelujah. Mina. Pastor from, uh, from uh, Switzerland. Our dear friend. Yes. Have you seen this before? Have you? No, no, it's amazing. It's so amazing. I'm so blessed to be here. I saw you dancing in the water and yes. rejoicing. And yes. It's the greatest joy in my life here to be here. It's wonderful. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Pastor Robert. For the yes, opportunity. Amen. Pastor, USA, Christ for all nations. I know you are involved in so many revivals. Even the late Bonke, you were involved in so many revivals. Your comment. I tell you what. The days that we're living in are very historic. I had saw one time in the diary. Of Evan Roberts, and he said that some people in his nation did not even know when they were in revival. Don't make the mistake. Jump into the waters of revival. Here at Miracle Center, it is the center of revival in Africa. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen and amen. What a privilege. I, I saw. I saw. Where is the brother? Come here from Rwanda. I know your pastor has just stepped out. But you come, 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 come. It's part of the delegation from Rwanda. Praise God. Amen. Amen. I've never seen anything like this in the world. This is the spirit of God working here. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. It's coming in Rwanda. It's coming to Rwanda. It's coming to Kenya. It's coming to the whole world. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And we are glad you came. You participated. You know, people are just arriving. People are just arriving. People are arriving to be baptized. And here he is. They are all coming to be baptized. The Lord is working. Miracle signs and wonders. Transforming people's lives. Now listen. This is just a beginning like they have said. You know you always must anticipate. Robert as we were planning. We said because we were supposed to be inside. We are supposed to be inside. But then the wedding department decided to have the 
the largest weddings on this day. They started wedding people by eight. They finished by four. And so there was no way we'll have all these young people in there. And you know, the Lord told us to, to build this truck for such a time like this. For such a time like this. Because with a system, in the church then you, you have problems in translating it outside but because we obey the Holy Spirit and we got a truck we are mobile we can go anywhere in Jesus name so the Lord said go outside and here we are here we are we can drive anywhere we can preach anywhere we can baptize now listen those of you watching my television, if you want to be blessed of the Lord, I want you to buy that mission department. Pastor David, come up here. I want Pastor David needs about 10 of these Baptist, Baptist trays. But at least buy one and give it to the ministry. And you can share it. The deliverance in the world. That one has been baptized. The demons are running away from them. Pastor David. Yes, Pastor. Come up here. Robert, come and come, stay with me. Pastor Naxa, stay with us. And uh, and uh, how are you? Pastor. The operation has been incredible because it's massive. You brought in tanks and tanks and and, and water bowsers and water yeah, bowsers it's of never water. Been, it's never been like this before. We are we run out at a thousand. Cards, uh, baptism cards. That was before you came. They have so the largest number yes. don't, don't have their baptism cards. We are just writing down their names. It has been incredible. The power of God. You know, I have never seen kids respond to baptism, little kids. Well, by the time Pastor Robert Jr. finished, it was just like there was a wind that was blowing over this place. Man. And you could just sense the surge of the Holy Ghost. I saw it. I was, I was watching it on TV. And I could see wow. the wave of the Holy Spirit. Yes. And I'm telling you, those of you mm. who have been baptized, please be here on the 24th, okay. which is a Saturday. It is your baptism party. Yeah. Wow. You will come, we will have a party, and we are also going to give you Christmas packages to take home. In the name of Jesus. You know, Pastor David, yeah. they said revival is in 2022. Oh but we did not know it's going to come like this. Oh we did not know it's going to come like Karamoja. Oh we did not know it's going to come like, I mean, it's quick. We could even... Kids have been saved this week. Oh the first day the altar call was incredible. Oh, the second day was incredible. Yesterday night. My God. My God. My God. Today. Lero. To God be the glory. Hallelujah. <laughs> Lift up your hand and shout revival is here. Revival is here. Now, so Pastor David, yes. on the on the Saturday fast, I, I've dropped it on you. Amen. So Amen. just get many Baptist trays. How much, how much does this thing cost? 10, 10 million. This is 10 million. Yeah, 10 million. So those of you watching my television, we need 10. That is 100 million Baptist trays. So that everywhere we go, Pastor David, we are not going to wait. We just go with our water bowsers. We preach. We baptize. We preach. We baptize. We preach, we baptize, we preach, we baptize. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! So on, on, the, on the third 
very fast. We'll start at 10. Let the people come. Come with two clothes. One for your baptism. Otherwise, we shall baptize you and you'll dry by the fire. <laughs> you'll dry by fire. In Jesus' mighty name. So that you enter the new year completely new. In Jesus' mighty name. My God, Father, thank you. Now listen. Because the Holy Spirit is strong. And he's moving. Let me prophesy to you. What's the time now? 9.15. The baptism started at 6. 7, 8, 9. Three hours. This is God. Hey, Pastor, come here. I, I ask everybody to come. Come and say something. In Jesus' mighty name. Listen. God is at work. Let me ask him a question. I know you're exhausted. Your brother said he has never seen anything like this. Have you ever seen anything like this? No, sir. And from yesterday, the only thing that is in my spirit is one song. Oh, it's coming in Rwanda. Rwanda. It's coming. It's coming. Listen. The time now is very crucial. That says the Lord. Mark this moment and this act today. As you are you accepted to be baptized in the water. Everything you had that says the Lord against you, stagnation, people. Abantu, frustration, okuiwa, lack, ebulwa, disease, edwade, fear, okutia, poverty, obavu, demons, emizimu, traditions, obulombo, obulombo, religion, edini. Whatever was negative, echibi, sin, echibi, iniquity, okuonona, bandages, obusime, it has been washed away from your life. If you believe it, lift your hand and jump and praise God. Now, that says the Lord. I have given you a new beginning. I have given you more than what money can give. Because you've chosen to glorify me. Like these new people who have just arrived. I told you people are getting into the cars. People are getting on their border borders. They are just arriving. We are about to finish and people are arriving. This is what they call revival. Hello. They were not part of the program, but now they are. You, God now has led you to go in a level you've never been before. You are the head and on the tail. You are powerful. God is going to use you. Your life will never be the same again. You will always go above and never beneath. In Jesus' mighty name. Therefore, rejoice. Praise. Rejoice. A new day has come. Miracles are on you. Blessings are for you. Now, join your hands together.
Jesus' name. We're going to breathe in seven times. Seven times. Leave it where it was. Seven times. On the seventh time, let it get away from those metals. Because when the power of God hit you, I don't want you to hit yourself from the wall. Those of you who are in the pool, hold on to the sides because the power of God is coming. I don't want you to drown here. The Spirit of the Lord is going to come upon you. The Bible said, Prophet Samuel told Saul, he said, when the Spirit comes on you, you will be turned into another man. You're not living here the same way. You're not concluding this conference and be the same. Even those of you watching by television at home. This is the time. This is the moment. You'll breathe in and out. Seven times. And the Holy Spirit will fill you. Some of you will fall. Some of you will shake. Some of you will tremble. Some of you will laugh. Some of you will cry. Some of you will burst in tongues. There's going to be variables of reaction. But that's what he does. But at the end of it all, you'll be wiser than yesterday. You'll be blessed and favored than yesterday. You will be protected. You will be a child of God. You, God will start using you. You will be rich. You'll be holy. You'll be righteous. And you'll change the world. Say holy seven times. Holy, holy, holy. Five, six, seven. Now breathe in. Breathe out. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Touch. 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 Now shout the name of Jesus 21 times. He's on you. He's on you. He's baptizing you. He's baptizing you. Lord, fill them. Fill us. Fill us. Fill us. With the Holy Spirit. With the Holy Spirit. Come on, pray. Ask him to fill you. Ask him to fill you. Come on. Start laughing. Start laughing. Start laughing. Start, laughing. Start praising. Start praising. Touch. Holy Spirit. Touch. The Holy Ghost is everywhere. He's everywhere. Come on, love. Come on, shout his name. Speak in tongues. He's 
power is everywhere. His power is everywhere. People are still arriving. People are being baptized. Even as the Holy Ghost is coming. Come on, go ahead and pray. He's on you. 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 And love. And pray. And yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bobo Shatarabo. Rederabo Shitarabo Shatarabashi. Rederabo Shatarabo. Come on, pray. Pray, pray. Pray, child of God. He's here. I don't know. Touch. Touch. God is delivering you from bandages, from sickness, from diseases, from fear. He's here. He's here. He's here. In Jesus' name. You want to be baptized? Step into the basin and be baptized. They are just arriving. Telling you. <laughs> yeah. People rejoice. Start laughing. Seka. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Muxagubo. You take off your sockings. Take off your sockings. You want to get baptized. They are arriving. They are arriving. The family has arrived. Come for Jesus. Baba no ba katuka. They have just arrived. Never gamble. I told you the Lord showed me. Never gamble. Mujje. I told you come. Linye motoka linye boda. Family yino ya katuka. The family has just arrived. Come for Jesus. Come for Jesus. To the moon revival. We are in revival.
Jesus has just arrived. Mandere rebo shitere rebo shatarara. Telling you people are just arriving. This is revival, Pastor David. In a revival. I've never seen anything like that when the Bible you know, baptism begins and people just come. Okay, Robert, I'm handing over to you. This is your meeting. I just fluked it. Oh, since he went, God, yes, oh, since he went. No one knew that revival would break out on the last day. So next week, we get ya. If you got baptized, what is it do? Or you showed up during riot and you're looking for a church. Or you're a young person looking for a youth ministry. Come next Saturday. Come next Saturday. Come meet us. We love you and you belong here. You belong here. Here. Young people won't find religion. You won't find us saying you're not good enough. No matter who you are, where you come from, this is your home. This is your home. And you're welcome. If you still want to get baptized, you can get baptized. Get baptized. Like my father said on the 31st, come join us. But more importantly, more importantly, today you're walking into forever. Today, you're walking into freedom. And as we leave, where's Josh? Hey, okay, Josh, come here. I don't know. I don't know what happened, Sachin. What happened? He was freezing. Where is he now? Sachin still freezing. Okay. As we leave, we're going to praise one more time. Why? Because we're letting the devil know he lost. Today the devil lost. Come on, Josh, let's go.